Yo, catch your Pokemon! Catch your Pokemon!
Search whoever you want mocked up to. Search. What's up? There it is. Holy shit. Search, how you feeling after uh, yesterday? Oh man, I I'm still hungover. <laughs> uh, you, you had a drinker stream yesterday, that? Search? Um, no, nah, I just got really drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, um... Who's getting married? <laughs> okay, that looks good, thank you. Um... You're welcome. Anytime. <laughs> oh, wait, it, is my stream not on the right stream? Oh, no, that's Adam's. Yeah. <laughs> Should I take mine down? I can take mine down. Um, I got yeah. Wes. Uh, yeah, I got Wes's up. It's fine. No, I'll take mine off. Cool. <laughs> Wes, you're doing great. All right, I rolled a five thousand. What? <laughs> yeah, can I? Should I roll it again? That probably nah, is. I'm good. That, and <laughs> if you want, dude, if you watch the stream, it's actually a relatively good intro, man. The whole stream gets covered in dice. Oh yeah, it's pretty cool. And then it melts in the in a pool of lava. <laughs> if my computer were will process it because it's taking a little bit, the page has frozen and is not responding. <laughs> Sick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does do that. <laughs> oh, 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 is it is it coming? Nope, not yet. Ah, there it is. There. It oh is. my god. <laughs> there it is. Ma, ma, my God! Nice. That's just crazy. Somebody just jizz die all over the screen. <laughs> Five thousand six hundred and thirty-nine. <laughs> one hundred D one hundreds. Did you fall from the sky? <laughs> <laughs> Freaking calling an interplanetary ballistic missile. Oh my god. <laughs> you have, you it's, like, wild it's like, alright guys, I'm casting a spell interplanetary ballistic missile. Um, so everyone make a dexterity saving throw, and then everyone takes 100 D100s, half if you succeed. <laughs> Dude, did you see that comment yeah. I sent you of some like goblin running up to some guy? He's like, Ew. And then he focuses really hard, and then you look behind him and upwards in horror as the sun just grows bigger and bigger <laughs> and bigger. <laughs> that's that's the five hundred five thousand damage. Five thousand damage <laughs> it causes the planet to explode. Where did you even learn how to do this, goblin? <laughs> All right, we all ready to go. You guys good? Yeah. All right, let's do this. So, Adam with the yeah! and uh, let's get this started. So I am Scourge live. We're playing D and D live. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Cheers. This is episode ten of Warriors. So last we left off. <coughs> the woman was running with her spears at the tavern. <laughs> nah, last we left off, you guys brought the kids uh, back to safety. Um, This one. Yeah, you brought them to their parents that were waiting for you at the gates. You guys got attacked by wolves on the way there, and then spiders when you got to there. Um, Took out the spiders, and then uh, got the kids to their parents that were waiting for them. One of the parents was shit out of luck, and then just ran, uh, ran away, crying, wailing after finding out one, uh, her child didn't make it. And uh, that's when Yogi I showed up, did. saying he, t he, yeah, <laughs> that's when Yogi showed up, and um, explained. Um, well, he he explained that he just got uh, back from another village where he just killed, uh, he cleared full of undead, and um, asked you guys if you got if you all did the same thing, which you guys did. 
and um, need to bring everyone back to Warrior HQ uh, to to figure out the the next step, basically. <laughs> so you're all in the briefing room. <laughs> Yusuka with the ray, let's go! <coughs> Thank you very much. <coughs> Thank you very much. Hope you had a good stream. He was playing Concord. Let's go. So, Yogi at the head of the room is going to debrief you guys. So, this isn't a church? No. It just looks oh, like it. It was the closest God. thing I could find right now. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> Um, almost choked on the raid. <laughs> All good. Um, so, what I was able to figure out... Oh, by the way, uh, hey, Bros, okay, she was able to snap out of it, but, uh, but, uh, what's it, what's it called? Kanye and, uh, and Griffin are still down. We're just gonna keep monitoring in the background while we figure out what's going on in, uh, with them, and what I'm going to tell you guys right now. I came back from the same village... Uh, clearing out the same undead zombies, the 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 magic uh, uh, the magic that's turning them undead uh, undead has all been like it's a similar magic being used the same time every time. Someone's doing this intentionally, and so I was able to uh, trace the uh, recent attacks uh, by zombies um, to uh, to a nearby cave just uh, just outside of Wayford. So I need you guys to go in, f figure out who's doing it, and just clear it out. Understood? Yo, okay. Copy. I'm, uh, I'm sitting next to a hay bra with a steak in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> with the steak in your hand. <laughs> are we talking like edible steak or like the no vampire? All type? steaks are edible. <laughs> If only once. Yeah. <laughs> Fine. I'm gonna Is go it with a you. once a time steak or a reusable steak? All depends on your constitution. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's the mission for now. I was able to trace it to the cave. Um, you guys uh, can go out and head out, just figure out what's going on in there, and just uh, report back. Any questions? No. Can I have some money for the for the adventure? Oh, shit. Sorry, I'm here. <laughs> Will there be anywhere to buy potions on the way? Yes, you guys can hit up whatever shops you need to before heading out. When do we leave? You are providing a rest for our adventure. What was that? Sorry, we have lots of questions. No, yeah, it's all good. Uh, Norm, no on the money. Uh, you guys are already getting paid. Quote, unquote. My, and, my <laughs> do, do we have enough time for my payment. <laughs> uh, what was that, uh, Koyan? Do we, do we have enough time for a rest? Oh, yeah, yeah. Her, oh, yeah. Let's say it's already nighttime right now. My bad. Uh, get some rest, head out, uh, get some rest, uh, get some supplies, and head out first thing, alright? Short rest? Uh, no, oh. you guys can, yeah, you guys can, uh, um... I seem after... to have blacked out. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, hey, bro, you're, you're alive and well and kicking. Uh, you're alive! So, yes, everyone, you can rest for the night, head out first thing in the morning, get whatever supplies you need, and head out first thing. Can I defer my payments for sexual favors? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> hey, that's my line. Oh, okay. what? <laughs> Yogi flashes out because he's fast as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so, you guys could do uh, whatever. So, are we long um, resting? Yeah, y'all can um, hit that long rest button and use the night to basically get whatever supplies you need. So go ahead, hit that long rest button, and then, um, what's it called? Uh, yeah, just hit that long rest button. Oh, we're also changing a few things here, too. Here, let me open up everyone's character sheets. 
It's like I woke up a different person. <laughs> so I woke weird. up with the zen in my mouth. I'll tell you that. <sighs> so. Hey, what am I? Um, we're we're changing everyone's total. Uh, to uh, I I don't like how it's fixed. I want everyone to have max HP. So total. Because like I in the I character sheet, like it's set to fixed, but I did. Um, I assumed it was gonna be max HP, but it isn't. I guess it's just an okay. average of HP of what your characters would get as you all level up and shit. I thought so, it was fine. What? I thought I rolled mine. Uh, your HP? Yeah. You did? I mean, I'm not, if you're gonna give me more HP, I'm not gonna argue. I'm gonna shut the fuck up. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, yeah. I want everyone to have a max HP, so... If you guys uh, have any questions on doing that, just, uh, just ask, and then we can get you guys straightened out real quick. Uh... I can pull up your guys' character sheet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, please. <laughs> okay, I so I think I'm only two away from the maximum I could have right now. Really? So, so then do it. <laughs> hey, bro, I'm gonna do yours real quick. Okay. Hold on, I'm, I'm double checking. I think my hit dies. Did he just do my Sergio? Um, yeah. Well, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm starting with Angela's first, real quick. Oh no, my hit dies are D tens. Yeah. That would be 36 hit points would be my max, if I reset it. Uh, I think I'm at max. It says fixed HP is 18. I'm at 21. Alright, because like in your settings where you can hit the button manage HP points, um, it, uh, there's a list called potential values, and use the number that says total possible HP. Oh, total possible. Yeah. Okay. Because fixed value has been, like, average, I guess, or whatever the fuck. So, whatever number you guys see in uh, under total possible HP, put that into the box that that has uh, that says override HP to whatever number that is. How do you get there right. again? Is that D&D uh, Beyond or the VTT? It's on D&D uh, &D Beyond through the character creator settings on your character sheet. Yeah, click on manager character. All right, so hey, bro, I well, just did yours. Right. Does anyone need help adjusting theirs? Thank we can you. do Ricky's next. All right, Ricky I, is next. I already I'm did try it. Oh, you did it. All out. right, cool, cool, cool. Sir, if anyone wants me, if that. anyone wants me to double check their shit, just tell me and I'll look so it up too. Can, can you check mine for me? I'm in my yeah. character sheet. <laughs> I'm on the creator. Okay, got gotcha. you. Three levels at a D10, plus my con mod of two would be 36 hit points max. Okay, gotcha. So here I'll check. I'll check yours, Koyan. Uh, class manage. It says total possible 36 for you. Yeah. All right. That's, cool. That's the, that's the math I came up with, but. All right, cool. Can you do mine now? <coughs> All right, I override coins. Uh, Ricky, you still need me to do yours? No, I'm good. You're Serge, good. Can you do mine? Yep, I got you. Uh, where are you, Dragon? All right, there we go. Not gonna argue with you more hit points, man. Yeah. <laughs> so for Dragon, it says 33 for you. That's your max HP. Hey, so you know how we were able to pick like a magical item a while ago? That was for the one shot. Oh, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm high. But I mean, Serge, that would be pretty fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'm not opposed. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to right now drop to my knees and pray to every god of the Pantheon to prove their existence to me by offering me a magic item. <laughs> not a bad idea. Um, you might end up with a curse. 
<laughs> I know, right? I'll give you guys cursed items. <laughs> yeah. Magic is magic. Magic is magic. Item. <laughs> Change it up. <coughs> like Rick's uh, HP forty-two. Rick's pawn shop. Or curse. Um. Yep, 34 shark bait. Yeah, that's better. How, how, how's that feel? How are you guys feeling? <laughs> We're fresh. We're new. <laughs> yes. Like, I have 16 zins on my asshole. <laughs> <laughs> All I right, can take so the world. All right, so I checked Koyans, I checked Dragons, I checked uh, Hey Bros, I checked shark baits, and... Oh, Wes, you good? Uh, I think so. I'm at 27 now. So that's like all right. All right. Points. Oh, and then one more thing, guys. Whenever you hit the lo uh, the long rest button, um, remember to uncheck the box that says reset maximum HP changes during this rest, because I think it just brings it back to uh, whatever the fixed value was. All right. Let me try that out. Yep. Yes, it does. What did you say? Yo, what's so, the hit? No, so, well, Wes, what's the hit die for uh, a bard? A D8? Yeah. Yes. Then you're not at your max yet. 27? Oh, yeah, 27, 27. Sorry. Your, your thing still shows 21. Yeah, no, it was uh, it was because I tried to do that thing that Serge just said about the long rest. Yeah, like, yeah, you know, when you hit the wrong, long rest button, for some reason, they have a checkbox already checked saying to reset your maximum HP, and it goes back, and it changes your max XP uh, back to the fixed value instead of what, instead of the maximum that, where, that I just gave you guys. Instead of, what, instead of what God just bestowed upon us. Yes, exactly. <laughs> well said, Adam. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, but yeah, just make sure to uncheck that when you hit that uh, before you hit the take long rest button. So yeah, and there was uh, our, our... yeah. You make sure to uncheck it where it says reset maximum HP changes during this rest because that will fuck up your max HP again. It does it for short rest too, so make sure to uncheck there whenever for short rest as well and shit. So yeah, everyone, all good then. <clears throat> yep. Um, for during the downtime, am I able to try to use my alchemist kit to turn the spider goo into a flask of acid? Yes, you can. Uh, let's roll. Give me a. Intelligence. What? Intelligence. Yeah. Let a hand. It'd be, um, yeah, give me, give, give me, uh, a, a, a nature, right? No, no, make it medicine. Yeah, give I'm me a medicine. <coughs> if I'm proficient with, uh, the alchemist supplies, do I get advantage or a plus to it? Um, I'd I say give it. Bonus, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, so add a plus two to this. Yeah, just add a plus two to it, yeah. Eleven. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, lost, I lost my spider gear, didn't I? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, it doesn't work out. Like, you kind of, um, like, you, uh, you almost had the, the right concoctions and everything, and just, like... You poured it onto something and just nothing happened. Oh, well, I tried. <laughs> Good job. Guys, I discovered how not to make acid. <laughs> Anyone else want to try licking it? <laughs> Anyone so else doing anything? I heard about mentioning going to the shop or whatever. Yeah, I'll go to a shop. 
be cool for me. What What are you trying to get? It's uh, shark bait uh, out for me. Probably some some healing items, more or less. You want to get some potions real quick? Yeah. So that will be at. <clears throat> Um, so yeah, that will be at the at the bell. The Unicorns Arcana in the Bell Ward District. So, um, yeah, the, the patron has a couple healing potions for you at, like, 50 GP apiece. I'll take a hit. What healing potion? Take a healing potion? Yes, sir. Go ahead, take, uh, W50 gold pieces, and then, you know, just add it to your inventory, or let me know if you need me to do it. Yeah, I think I got it. Wait, it's 50 gold pieces for a health potion insanely high. <laughs> no, it's about normal. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a regular potion of healing. It does a 2d4 plus 2. Uh, anyone else getting one? Can you get me one of them? Oh, I don't even know how to look I at my, my, my inventory through here. Are you on your phone or on the computer? Time's on are rough, computer. man. You're on the computer? So, yeah. hit where it says inventory. Do you Is see it? On, the... on your character sheet where it says inventory. Oh, okay, I see it now. And then, yeah, you can click that button on the side. It pulls up the side menu and then, you know, it lets you fuck with your, with your money. <laughs> It's so, Ricky, that'll be... Yeah, it's 50 gold pieces. So, yeah, I only got 16. Oops, just that goes that. One. <laughs> I guess it's 50. Is anyone else trying to get the, a healing potion, then? Still got a few more. Nah, I'm good. Uh, so Ben, uh, uh, I mean, sorry, Dragon and Koyan, you guys good then? Would, would I have enough time if I tried making the, uh, top, the acid to still go to the store with them, or is that instead of going with them? Uh, say again? The fact that I tried making the acid. Yeah. Does that take my free time before the long rest? Uh, no. So, I would have time to go to the store with them, right? Yeah. Can can I buy a bag of ball bearings? A bag of ball bearings? Uh Yeah, it's like I think I think it's a pretty common item if we go to like a blacksmith or whatever. I'm making you look shit up, ain't I? Yeah. So <laughs> Here's a bag of ball bearings. There's a thousand of them. And... How, how much? This will be... Can't be more than five silver. It'll be one GP. One gold piece for the bag of ball bearings. Awesome. Thank you. All right. All good, everyone? You guys good with the shop? Am I able to trade yeah. my great sword? You want to sell it? <clears throat> yeah. Uh, the great sword, I can... I can give you 25 gold pieces for it. Hold on. Hmm. If I add my great axe to that, can we get a combined deal where we get a little bit more? Here, let me see what's up. Yeah, you might as well throw mines in there too.
And then, Ricky, you said you were throwing in what? Uh, my great axe. Your great axe? Alright. Uh, this is it's cursed. <laughs> and I'll throw in my javelin. You're throwing in a javelin? <laughs> yeah. Just one javelin? Just a single javelin. You guys are making me do so much fucking math right now. Give me a second. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> is this how it feels like? <laughs> it's almost like this is D and D. A lot better. Yeah, good. Good soup. It would be hilarious if someone decided they didn't want to sell their item after it did all the math. <laughs> you guys will be no. dicks. <laughs> I do have some sentimental value. Hey, Wait, so Wait. it was two great axes, a great sword, three. right? It was three great, great, great axes. Wait, wait, are you throwing down three great axes? No, no, no. Pick Rick is throwing down, or Sharkbait is throwing down a great axe. I'm throwing down a great axe. Oh. We got Dragon throwing down a great sword. And no Norm is thrown in a javelin. Okay, so Alright, the great axe. A great axe plus a great sword. I mean I'm sorry, a great sword plus a great axe plus a great axe plus a javelin. A javelin, all right. Hey, bro, you have anything you want to throw in? Huh. Nah. Yes, actually, you know what? <laughs> um, I hope it's yeah, I'm, I need to, I need to sell, um, a, I have those three gems on me. Three gems? Yeah, they're 50 GP each. Oh, God. Uh... <laughs> Hey, bro, we're, we're all throwing this in together to split it, so just be aware of that. That's fine. <laughs> um, Alright, so how many gemstones are you trading in, then? Three. <laughs> three, three at 50 apiece, is what you said? Uh-huh. Alright. Guys, we That's... have the power to take all, like, every little town's economy. <laughs> mm. <laughs> With that, I can give you guys... Mm, like two hundred, two silver pieces. <laughs> wow. No, I, I go. I can give you guys like two twenty for the whole thing. Two hundred to uh, twenty gold pieces. I throw in a hug and you give me two twenty five. Wait, what? Yeah, everyone get all. Wait, say again, uh, shark bait. We'll throw in a hug, and if you give us an extra five gold pieces. Nah, nah, nah. How about, nah, 210 instead? Whoa. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Wait, I'm just kidding. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> the shopkeeper's fucking with you. Nah, 220. I do not go down his table. <laughs> <laughs> is that, does that sound fair to you guys, or you all want to haggle? <laughs> Let's haggle. Mm. Right now, I just want Haybron to be aware of this. She put up three 50 gold piece worth gems. And if we divide everything together, we each get 44 gold pieces. I don't mind sharing. Thank you. Nice. Holy moly. Right. I put the steak away. <laughs> the steak <laughs> away! <laughs> <laughs> All right, 220 gold pieces. Go ahead and add 44 gold pieces to your character sheets, guys. Will that be all for everyone shopping throughout the districts today? Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. Alright, yeah, so y'all have... have one back. <laughs> what was that? I was just asking for my back one back, but I think it's too much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all head back to Warrior HQ, get some rest for the night, you um hit the long rest button, get ready for the mission uh, in the morning. So it's first light. You guys 
it, 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 it's not that far out. You'll get there and back within a day, basically. So, um, I mean, you guys, you guys can walk there, or you know, you can have like the horse and wagon. Wagon. And we still have the horse. But and somebody wagon. else has to drive because I crashed. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we got a horse and wagon. We might as well take the horse and wagon. The speed wagon. We, we have a horse <laughs> and wagon? <laughs> yes, you were brought back with the audio. All Actually, up. we should all walk. Uh, what was that, Adam? No. Is anyone else's audio on Discord all fucked up? Like, like cutting out or something? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's fine on my end. Are you guys all good? Uh, right now, I'm I've been okay. good. It was cutting in and out for a little Adam, while is it me. the whole thing for you, or is it specific person's voice cutting out? Like, if it's just me, or what? It's definitely you. Like, I'm cutting out. Yeah, it, it sounds... Oh, okay, so, alright, let me check like, my right, right, set... On let me check my... Or? It sounds fine on Discord. Okay, so it might just be me, man. Just go wait, with it. I'll figure it out. Wait, you, uh, but you're talking about on Discord, right? Yeah, let me hop off Discord and re jump in and see if that fixes it. Okay. Sir, do you mind um, putting in a 44? Well, wait, no, Ricky, Ricky you're much. cutting out. <laughs> it's Ricky's cutting out. <laughs> what was that, Ricky? I'm refreshing my screen, that's why. Oh, okay. Uh, I didn't hear you. What did you want me to do? He left. Oh. Is there is there like a firearm shop somewhere in the city? A firearm shop? Uh, Very specific, but I would like to also find that. Better? Out. Uh no, not at the moment. <laughs> not at the moment. <laughs> okay. that bad? There, there's a shop being built in the city. You'll have one soon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's under construction. <laughs> they passed it to the city council and everything. <laughs> hmm. So that means that firearms do exist. Perhaps we'll find a trader somewhere along the road, huh? Fuck it, why not? <laughs> um, is Ricky back? Yeah, I'm here. Oh, yeah. what did you want me to do? Because I didn't, I didn't hear you. The 44 gold, if you put, if you can. I'm trying to. Manage oh, oh, my okay. Inventory. I got you. I think. Inventory 44 gold. Add the do. All right, you're good, Ricky. You do get that fast. All, All right. right. So, yeah, y'all rest for the night. Prepare for the mission. Hop on the wagon, right? So, uh, and you guys head out. Who's the driver, who's the passenger, and who's in the carriage? I'll be the passenger this time. I'll drive this time. I cannot drive. Do not let me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be in the back with hey, bro. Yeah. Okay, I so wait, who said was the driver again. again? Who was the driver again? My bad. Yeah, shark bait. All right, shark bait. Who's on the passenger with him? Dragon. Dragon. Dragon's the passenger. All right. Yes, sir. Um, and then everyone else in the carriage. Then I'm on oh, top. And uh, with Norm on top. All right, cool. So, you all ride out of the town, out of Wayford, on the way to the cave. You're going through a kind of, like, kind of wooded, a, a somewhat wooded area um, with roads in them and shit. Uh, on the way there, uh, you notice the, a, you guys see a crashed wagon in the middle of the road. So, let me bring you in. Real quick. Uh, 
guys, okay. we've done this before. I don't even fucking care. What was that? I, I looked at everyone else. I'm like, guys, we've we've done this before. I don't I don't even fucking care what's there. No. <laughs> <laughs> Spider you want to get giant spiders? This is how you get giant spiders. <laughs> Norm? No. No, no, not the spiders. Not again, no. But, but there could be some fun stuff there. There are boxes. Let's search the wagon. Can I search the wagon? Um, it, uh, it's in the way, so, like, yeah, you guys can search it. So, um... Oh, it's, it's blocking our path, anyway. So... Uh, uh, you hear coming from Angela's, uh, back. Yo, there's something here! There's something <laughs> here! And it's loud. <laughs> and the sword's pretty fucking loud. <laughs> I, I immediately ripped both of my, uh, rapiers. Excuse me. Coming out into sight, you all see five zombies. Oh, because you guys great. are never surprised because you guys have a talking axe. Yay! <laughs> I'm up front with Hebra. Let's go. So, yep. Uh, these five, uh, no, I'm sorry. Yeah, five zombies come out of the woodwork. Everyone roll for an initiative. Oh, fuck me! Hee <laughs> hee. <coughs> oh, I feel so bad. We'll take care of all Alright, I see initiative for Norm. Hey, bra. Draggle. No, it's really down low for me. Oof, oof, okay, gotcha. So, the zombies come out from around the wagon. Uh, Koyan, give me an, uh, an insight check real quick. Thirty twenty. Okay, thirty twenty. You know that all of these undead in front of you, right? How uh, the they're not the normal type, like like been a while undead decomposing shit. It's like the these people were just recently turned. So with mm -hmm. that being said, uh, top of the initiative, hey bra. Initi initiative. Um. Oh no no you go, go first. first you go, go first. first yeah right? yeah okay. Oh fuck. Okay. Um <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna throw Norm. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm next. I'm doing it now <laughs> It's fifty it's fifty fifty one fifty three feet to the middle of them. I did have um, the maps gridded out, guys. It should be working. So, yeah. <laughs> I did remember to do it that this time. Right, I'm also I'm... positioned by your right arm, perfect for throwing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I'm gonna move forward, though. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna right here. That would have been I... hilarious. <laughs> like, Go! I'm like, <laughs> 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 So you can move there. Yep, and then um, uh, I'm 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 just that's it. I can't I can't do nothing else really. I'm gonna just stay there. All right. Next up is Norm. Norm. Um, I will run to here. I, actually, I think I forget where it was. It was right there. Why do you always have a glowing circle around you? Because she sets an aura up. Oh, yeah, bro. Oh, that's what that it does. Is. Nice, cool. <laughs> uh, and I it helps into... find him. Yeah, okay. it helps a lot. <laughs> 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 it 
It's like putting a bell on his neck. No. <laughs> did he go? Oh, he's over there. <laughs> All right, so you move 25 feet. What, what else do you do? I pant heavily because that's as far as I can run. <laughs> <laughs> I roll for stealth? Um, yes, you can. Is. You want to hide, basically? Yes. Do I roll advantage if I'm on stone? Mm, that is next to a stone, yeah. Roll another d20. Yes. No. <laughs> Wait, that one's better. <laughs> Wait, that one's better. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, you're hidden within the rock standing there. Yeah. Well, with the rock, yeah. <laughs> I am the rock. <laughs> All good for your turn? <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> Wait, where'd he go? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> God starts screaming. <laughs> All right. Next up, one of the zombies is gonna go up to Hebra. And we'll make a swing. Goes with the slam attack. No. Damn. That's an 11 to hit. Pretty sure that misses. And that will end that zombie's turn. Then this one is going to go also over <laughs> over here. And then it's going to gain advantage on the on the attack. That's uh that's a miss. Then the next zombie is going to go here. And then next up is shark bait. Hmm. I want to move here. Get an advantage on that zombie there. Yep. Roll for advantage. Oh, guys, uh, new house rule for, for the virtual table, too. Whenever you guys get a crit, don't hit the, the button that rolls the dice for you. Make it a custom roll for, um, and just do the math out. So Because I like it when we double whatever we roll instead of doubling the dice. You guys go with that? What you mean? So we'll re you have to we'll walk re me through that. You mean like including yeah, the modifier? Yeah, yeah, because in, yeah, yeah, including the including the modifier, you can add it up because um uh oh, so like oh yeah, 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 because on D and D Beyond, if you roll the crit and then you know you hit the button for your dice damage and it rolls double the dice, I like it where you just roll um. You roll whatever you roll initially, the one to um the original amount of dice, but then you just double whatever's mathed up, basically. Or double the total. Yeah, double, double the total. The yeah, yeah, double the total instead of doubling the dice. Is that you guys Plus go with that? Right. Yep. All right. So times two of the dice. <laughs> yeah. Right. After your dice roll and add your modifier, just double it. But the but you know D and D Beyond does it, so don't hit the the button the dice button on the on your character sheet because it's gonna roll double the dice anyways. Just make it a custom roll whenever you gotta you know roll for your for your crits basically. But yeah, um, yeah. What you gonna do, Shark Bait? I'm going. Do I want to guess? <laughs> <laughs> the monk. 
Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna hit it with an on on strike. So I just for this event, you said that just for a crit roll, a critical hit ho roll, right? Hit. Yeah, just just for yeah, just whenever you uh you roll a crit, a roll of twenty. What's a crit? Oh, okay. Yeah, whenever you roll a twenty, that's a crit. Unarmed strike to hit. You gain advantage too, so roll it again. Shit. Um. Yep. The the fifteen hits. Go. Uh, go roll your dice damage. Seven. Nice. Good shit. Um, blurry of flows. Blurry of flows. <laughs> Get an advantage, right? Yep, it's all still advantage. Roll it again. Yep, eighteen that hits. Six, nice dude. Um, I said I'm out of turns, right? Uh, you get one more unarmed strike because you used flurry of blows. Holy moly! <laughs> yeah, that's the cool thing about being a monk, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, roll another unarmed to hit. Ooh, with advantage. Oh, okay, okay. Wow. So you say right now? Ro um, roll again. You you hit just, but just roll for um to hit again because it's still technically advantage. I just want to see the numbers. <laughs> okay, so yeah, a nat twenty twenty five to hit definitely goes. So your unarmed strike is a plus uh is a d four plus three. Do make it a custom roll. So um. Hit the pyramid button or whatever dice roll. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, wait, no, I think it's, uh... Oh, that's weird. You're good, then. And then it's critted, so that's 10 fucking damage. Oh. Um... <laughs> okay, I see what you did there. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I so... didn't know that. So yeah, I'd rather yeah, I'd rather it just roll the one dice and then we just double the damage. I feel like that's better. Um okay. there. So, um, you come up, you, you come up to the zombie, just like one, two, three, third one, knocking its head off. And it is dead. <clears throat> Anything else? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm chilling right here. You still have like, I think another like 15 feet of movement. Or are you just going to stay there? Mm. I'll stay right here. I'll move right here. Okay, gotcha. So, uh, next up, this zombie is going to go... Here... And a slam attack on Haybra. Hey, 
I'm pretty sure. All right, that was a natural one. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Then this zombie is going to go here. And then next up is Koyen. Going to run up to this dude. We're going to take some of the rapier. Thirteen to hit. Thirteen to hit. Yes, that hits. Pumpkin Alley with the hundred biddies. Thank you very much. And another fifty with the with the emote. Thank you so much. Six damage. Six damage dealt to the zombie. Let's go. Offhand attack. Sixteen to hit. That hits. Seven damage. Seven damage. Last five feet of movement. I'm going to move. You there? I'm not. I'm good. Whoa. Oh, what's going on? Hey, is your guys' PTT bugging out? Yeah, I keep getting a Dungeon Master above PTT thing. Yeah. Yay. I guess just refresh, guys. For some reason, it paused. I don't know. I didn't yeah, even know there was a... Yeah, yeah, I didn't even know there was a pause button. I'm refreshing my shit, too, now, just to be sure. All right. Uh, you guys good? Oh yeah, yeah sure. there is a pause button. It says pause players. That's fucking nuts. Wait, where? I'm it, it's for me. It's on my screen. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I'm yeah. Good. Yeah, I think it's back to normal. All yeah, right, cool. So you're good, Coyan? Yeah, I stabbed him twice with the rapier, and then I moved five more feet to the north of him. All right, cool. Next up is is Dragon. I'd like to use my uh, infestation cantrip. Fuck yeah, dude! It's a uh, con thirteen. Um, what are you using it on, or is it an area of effect? <laughs> I forget. Um, here, let's see. All right, infestation. What it's I a range of 30 feet. Range. Yeah. All right, yeah, 30 feet. We can see in range. Okay, yeah, so you said Constitution saving throw? Mm -hmm. So the oil one's the blue guy. Yep. Uh, Constitution 13? Mm-hmm. All right, let's see. Um, rolling for constitution. That's a seven. It's <laughs> <laughs> wow. just the one damage. <laughs> and then I roll a d4 for direction of movement <laughs> in five feet. Hells yeah, go for it. South, five feet. Uh, south. Uh huh. Goes right here. Gets knocked over here. All good. Uh, 
then I would like to move right here. Yo, catch your Pokemon! Catch your Pokemon! And then I'm all good. Um, okay, cool, 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 cool. Next up is Hebra. All right. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to go into a rage. Heels, yeah. Bro! You're so calm about that. <laughs> I'm sounding like you're giddy about it. <laughs> I would like to rage. Yeah, I'm gonna go into a rage. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> and then I am going to. Let's see, where is it? Mm hmm. Okay, I'm also gonna go into a frenzy. Okay, that, that I'm that, I'm just letting you know that there's nothing to click for that. <laughs> nice. Okay, and I'm gonna wait. Attack. Wait, I think you used the. Uh... I have three rages. I use one rage. Yeah. I'm gonna smack this one right here. So, and do I I still roll with um advantage right because I'm raging. No, I think it's regular. You, uh, I think it's a regular roll. Is it regular? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you just get advantage on strength checks, strength. saving throws, okay. and you get yeah. the plus two to melee damage. That's the thing. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. So, so that's 12. a 10 plus two, 12 damage to. Uh, I'm sorry, which one again? Uh. This boy. That one? Alright, 12 damage to the zombie. What is it? Oh, yeah, it's a talking great axe, right? So. <laughs> yes. That's a 9, does it hit? Wait, what? Sorry, no, 10 to hit and then 9 oh. damage. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm sorry, yeah. 10 to no, hit, okay. that hits, and then the 9 damage plus 2 makes it 11, and then, uh, yeah, you're good. All good? Yep, that I shot in my turn there. Heels here. Next up is uh, Norm. Norm. Alrighty. I will run up here next to Hebra. The stealth oh. is broken. Stealth is broken. I lift my shirt up. I smack my belly as loud as I can, casting Thunder Wave. And. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Where are you going to put Boom. it? It has to originate from me. Oh, right, yeah. Sorry, hey, bro. You might be deaf for a second. <laughs> you might be deaf <laughs> okay. for a second. <laughs> okay. Yeah, each creature in a 15-foot cube <laughs> uh, must make a constitution saving throw. On a failed save, the creature takes 2d8 thunder damage and is pushed oh. 10 feet away from you. On a success, the creature takes half of uh, half as much and isn't pushed. So that's a do constitution I, of 12. Do I have so, to roll? <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. <laughs> Fine. See? See? No problem. I yeah, I think I'm good. <laughs> yeah. I'm taking one damage. <laughs> um, so you saved, you take... Wait, uh, Norm, did you roll your Thunder Wave damage? Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah, he did three damage. A three damage! <laughs> 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 Alright, 
<laughs> All right, so yeah, Haybrot uh, only takes one damage. <laughs> that stung. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it isn't pushed back, and then it hits three zombies as well. So let me roll their shit real quick. Why is yeah, the air spicy? <laughs> My so, belly here got in the way. So an 18. A 16. And a 13. Wow, they all... They all uh, <laughs> yeah, they, they all, all saved. It. They all saved. Also don't get pushed back. And then they all take uh, one, <laughs> one damage, damage as well. <laughs> uh, Beep. I end my turn. Well, that's crazy how nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> my belly hair got in my way. I forgot to shave this morning. <laughs> this is what an intro looks like. <laughs> Next up, uh, all right. So you say you're good, right? Next, last mission. <laughs> You said you were good then, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, the one in front of Haybra is gonna take a swing at her. That's an 11 to hit. That misses. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be quicker than that. Yeah, then the next zombie is going to... This one is going to swing at uh, Haybra with advantage. That's a, that's a nat 20. I'll show that to you guys. So that's a D six plus one. <laughs> that's D six plus one. Doubled. Let's roll. Pfft, you take you take two bludgeoning damage. Oh no! <laughs> Halved because you're raging. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Ending that zombie's turn next to shark bait. <laughs> Alright, I wanna I wanna um my arms of Astro Self. I'm gonna pull them bad boys out. So you use that as a bonus action to bring them out, I believe. Oh uh, it says action here. No, yeah, but you have to bring it out as a bonus action. I gotta hit. So I gotta hit first. Yeah, as a bonus action, yeah. you can. Su yeah, yeah. As a bonus action, you spend one key point to summon it, and then uh, when you do, so each creature of your choice that you can see within ten feet of you must succeed on a dex saving throw, DC twelve, or take two D four damage. Shit, dude. There's one within ten feet of them. Well, I can move. I gotta move. I just did that like a dummy. So yeah, yeah, that's fine. You learn, dude. Um, so you can reach. You can reach this one then, right? Yeah. I can't move. I like, since I said that, I can't move. So that zombie's gonna roll. Um, deck save a twelve. Deck save. Um, yep, so... Um... That's a six. So Ricky gets to roll 2d4 damage on it? Yep, uh, hit the 2d4 button on the, on the arms, dude. It's under your bonus action. 
okay. Okay, okay, that, that zombie takes four damage. And, Bad. uh... Bad. Oh, I pulled up the wrong character sheet. <laughs> God, it's like you have one job. <laughs> <laughs> so because the zombie failed uh for uh and then also says for 10 minutes you can use wisdom in place of strength of making straight checks of saving throws and you can use the spectral arms to make unarmed strikes all right cool that's pretty neat so that happens um you all good you still have an you still have uh, an action to use up. All right, so as my action, my arms are actually so I'm just gonna hit that guy again. Can it reach from that far? Or do you have to within ten feet? It says. Got a ten foot range. Oh my god! <laughs> god damn! <laughs> Yeah, I guess you can't hit from there. That's pretty dope. Uh, 19 does hit. Go ahead and roll your damage of your ghost arms. A forcing damage. Right. Burn. Yeah, seven. it's force damage instead. Seven damage. Uh -oh. To the little blue guy. So, one of, the, one of the ghost arms just reaches out 10 feet away and just completely obliterates that zombie into the ground. Killing it off. Good shit. Anything else for your turn? Mm. You can still move, you still got your movement. So I, got, I still got all my movement, right? Yeah. That's crazy, you can punch from 10 feet. That's actually pretty dope. Who's next? Call me. So, you gonna move there? Or you, um... I'm gonna slightly... I, I'm gonna slightly try to... on top of these boxes. Gotcha. <laughs> so you move there, hop on top of some boxes. And then, uh, this zombie is going to take a swing at Norm. That's a 13 to hit. That hits. Dealing five uh five bludgeoning damage onto the gnome bod five yes five bludgeoning then ah. this one is going to walk up to to shark bait and take a swing that's a 17 to hit that hits on damage, seven bludgeoning damage onto shark bait. Ricky, you got it, or do you need me to do it? Yeah, you're gonna have to do it. All right, seven damage dealt to Ricky, and then uh, next up is Koyan. Gonna move right here. I'm gonna swing at that guy. That's advantage. 19 to hit. That hits. Max damage of 13. Nice, dude. Still standing? 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna swing again. Yo, catch your Pokemon! Catch your Pokemon! 21 to hit. That hits. Oh, uh, six damage. Six damage out, still standing. Just <laughs> oh, good. Mm. Yeah, I'm good. All right, so next up is Dragon. I would like to move down this way and cast my Sacred Flame Cantrip. The Sacred Flame Cantrip? It's a Dex 13. All right, Dex 13. Um, wait, which one are you hitting it at? At the orange one here. The orange one? Okay, so... Dex saving throw. That's an 11, so it fails. Nice. Ooh, nice. Good shit, dude. So just, um, so Dragon steps up a few feet, weaves a sign, and just th the zombie just randomly fucking bursts into flames, taking fire damage. <laughs> Will that be all for drag on? Yes. <coughs> Next up is Hebra. Okay. All right, bet I'm a uh, smack this boy. <laughs> smack this bad boy. Yeah, I'm gonna smack that boy. <laughs> um. Since um, I was raging and I chose to go into a frenzy last round, um, I can use, uh, I have an uh, extra attack, I have a bonus action attack. You can make so a I, single melee weapon attack as a bonus action on each of yeah. your turns after. Oh, that's pretty dope. Yeah, so, yeah, go for it. So, I'm going to smack him twice. So... All right, go ahead. Give me your attack action. 24 hits. Roll your damage. Ten damage. Oh, nice. Yep, ten damage because you're raging. The one right in front of you, right? Yes. Okay. And then I'm going to smack him again. Mm. Seven. Seven damage? Mm-hmm. Is he still alive? <laughs> you hit it hard with the first swing, and on the second swing, you were able to chop its head off. <gasps> yeah. Just out of sheer fucking anger. <laughs> In a giggly type a anger. <laughs> <laughs> Would that be all for Mommy. your turn? That'll be all for my turn. Next up is Norm. Um, <clears throat> uh, I'll take a swing at the zombie in front of me with my rapier. With the rapier? <laughs> Oh, I can find it. Ta -ta. Ah, the not twenty. Uh, hold on. Wait, what? 
Oh, not 20. Nice. Okay. okay. So 4 plus 5, 9 times 2. Wait. Yeah, 4 plus no, 5. No, no. It rolled the 2 D8s. It? it rolled the 2 D8s for you. Just instead make a custom roll and roll your D8, the, the 1 D8, and we're just going to add 2 to it and then double it. Damn. One D8. Yeah, make a custom roll for just 1 D8. Roll. 7. All right, Sorry. seven plus two. Oh, plus right? two. Yeah, two. Dude, two's your modifier, I believe. Uh, yes, nine, so eighteen. Yep, eighteen fucking damage. Um, nope. you said the one right in front of you, right? Yes. You're able to jump up and slit this fucker's throat out. Yay. <laughs> Killing it. <laughs> I gave him a little boost. <laughs> boost. Alright. Will that be all for your turn or what's up? Uh I guess I can still keep moving. Uh, yeah. So move here and attack with my other hand with a dagger. Bollocks, that's nine to hit. Nine to hit. That hits. Oh, okay. Uh, five damage. Five damage on the yellow one. Um. How do you want to do it? Right through the belly button and tickle his spinal cord right up against the inside of his spine. <laughs> his vertebrae. Jesus! <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alrighty oh, that's then. That's making me hurt just thinking about <laughs> it. Rather we make a few discs though, along the way. <laughs> yes, I like to get close and intimate. Alright, so, um. Yeah, that's, uh. That's it. You killed, uh, five freshly made zombies. Are they on the way to the cave. Edible? What? <laughs> edible? <laughs> what? Uh, I'm I'm sorry. I, I, are they um uh uh, uh, uh rescuable? <laughs> <laughs> rescuable? <laughs> what do you mean Damn. by that? What are you trying to do? <laughs> we can't bring them back to life. I didn't say anything about you. Then. Oh, never mind. Anyways, moving on. What? Where's Goji? <laughs> Where's Goji? <laughs> Yogi? He's Yogi. off on a mission. <laughs> Anyways. Okay. So, all you guys gotta do is there's a wagon in the way. Just push it out and you guys can continue on. Can I search the wagon? The wagon? Search the wagon. <laughs> Search the wagon. Give me an investigation check. Can oh. I help him? Yes, with advantage. One of yous. One of us? Can we both roll? And no, no. You so you can either help Adam and help him roll both separately. Yeah, I'll help. I'll help you, Adam. All right. So know. yeah, Koyan oh, rolls for advantage on the investigation check. That's a twenty-one. Nice. With a 21, you guys find... Um... Wait, where is the... Oh, okay. There it is. Okay, so... Sorry, I just gotta...
Oh, I'm doing it wrong. Shit, my bad. Um... All right, so someone write this down. <laughs> you guys got found, uh... 2,200 copper pieces. 2,200 copper. And... Five hundred silver pieces. Nice. Five hundred silver. And right now it's only me and uh, Dragon that knows about this. <laughs> and a mimic. No, I'm just kidding. It's uh, <laughs> it's Damn. eighty gold pieces. <laughs> so that's what uh Poyan and uh and Dragon found. Poyan, Poyan. We should only share the bronze. What you guys selling over there? What you guys find? No. Everyone Wait. get four hundred. Everyone had 440 copper. <laughs> <laughs> so, they, fi oh, they, fi they find this money. Uh, Dragon whispers over to, to Koya and says, Yo, we should only give them the copper pieces. Koya turns around and yells out to everyone. Everyone add, uh, add uh, here's some copper pieces I found. 440? Are you giving us three the 440? Or are you what? How much did you say everyone gets each atom? Everyone gets 440 copper. And I'm sorry, Dragon, but uh, everyone should also take 100 silver. <laughs> oh, thank you. I did not know you found also silver. <laughs> How much silver was it? 100. Thank you, good sir. <laughs> May I investigate this this pile of uh, crates? Everyone added their money. We're good. Dragon, you can do the math, right? <laughs> Everyone. Um, mm -hmm. Yep. Cool. All yeah, good with your one. monies. With your purses? Yeah. yeah. All right, let's go. So yeah, we just gotta get the uh, the wagon out of the out of the way. You guys can can get to the cave. I can move it. Can I? Can I? Is there more stuff to investigate? Is there something you're trying to look for? I mean, there's crates over here. The crates hey, um, um, are, are right busted back. open. They've been emptied and looted. Oh, okay. Never mind. So, um... I'll give Habra a hand if she's trying to move it. Alright, Habra and, um, and Koyen go to the wagon. Habra, go ahead and give me, uh... Do a great... An athletics, an athletics check with advantage. I'm literally just standing there saying, I believe in you. <laughs> I shall assist. Yo, how much? How much? Hey, bro, 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 hey, bro roll, 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 roll athletics with advantage, please. She's raging. I think she already had advantage. Uh, Angela? She said she'd be back. Oh, really? I forgot that happened. Wow. 
May I try pushing the wagon out the way? I will help Norm. I will help them too. All right, Norm. Want, uh, athletics, athletics check with advantage. advantage. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so you got Thank most God. of the shit out of the way. Um, ah, be strong. <laughs> As I'm picking him up by the waist. <laughs> <laughs> so you managed He's to like, move the wagon like just out of the way, like enough space for your 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 guys' wagon to get through. But it's not even like entirely off the road yet. <laughs> That's enough. You guys hey, come on. <laughs> oh man. I did this. <laughs> How much time would it take to throw the dead zombies on the broken wagon? Um, onto the broken wagon? Probably, um, not even like half hour. Shouldn't take long. Cool. Uh, I want to work with everyone to throw the bodies on the broken wagon and then bring up my tinderbox and set up a blaze. Oh, shit. Okay, do your thing. Give me, uh, anyone gonna help? Uh, I will just take it, um... I'll help, Adam. I'll just take an athletic checks from, uh, from Koyen, and you can roll for advantage. Since Dragon's gonna help. I hope so. Yep, everyone's helping. Just roll for advantage, Koyan. That's a six. <laughs> Let me, strong norm, do it. <laughs> <laughs> so, you got uh, one body in there. <laughs> <laughs> With the help of everyone. Say fuck it. <laughs> so, you guys ready? To, you guys ready to head out? What do you? Uh, anything else you want to do? Or are you guys good? Yep, we should head out. Yep. Go we on to the Go on the On to the horse. All right, cool. Everyone, level up to four. Oh fuck yeah, you're amazing. We're gonna uh, hey, we're gonna start up. doing milestone. Uh, I'm not giving the XP out anymore. It's annoying. <laughs> hey, I I still got. Uh, I'm at I'm already at level four. So we'll take a break here, basically, so we can get make sure everyone's character sheets are leveled up, and then yeah. So I'm who needs help? Sure. I do. Hey, we're taking a how long of a break? Um, let's try and get this done in like. 10 to 15 minutes, I guess. Okay. So, alright, I'm opening up Shark Bait. Alright, level 4 Monk. You get an ability score improvement um, or a feat. Which one do you want to do? Mm. And feats. I'll for feats. Features like a... Just random abilities or whatever? It's a lot. You, you're gonna have to go through it. Sure. Or you could just... Or you could just boost up your points. Do you... Uh, if you want to look for, for a feat, uh, go, uh, go to your character sheet settings. Alright. And then I have the feat part of that uh, open. You can just... Click on the drop down. You can just select it and look through whatever you want. But um, so you can either do that or get an ability score improvement, where you can uh, choose two ability scores to increase. Do the ability score improvement. You want to do the ability score improvement? Yeah. All right. So you get to choose two. What do you want it to be? I feel like as a monk, what was it? They they min uh they min max dex and wisdom first, right? Yeah. So you want to put it in dex and wisdom, 
or Dex and Dex or Wisdom and Wisdom. I can't do I can't do my armor class, right? No. This this is just your, your ability scores, yeah. Straight. It says strength. Constitution. Wisdom. Um mm. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna look for a feat actually. Alright, go into your settings, look for a feat, and then you can just select whatever you want. You can just select it, it'll it'll keep showing off and you can if you don't like it, just you know, select another one or whatever. And just let me know when you're done, okay? That's the only thing you have to change. So, are you in there looking? Yeah, I'm looking in there now. All right, cool. Anyone else need help? Koi, and you're good? So, working on I'm, mine. I should be good. All right. Angela, do you need help? Angela. All right, uh, who else? Wes, are you good? Uh, what what are we doing? Leveling We're leveling up, up. Yeah, level up to four. Yeah, I leveled up to four. But is there something else I have to I can do like in my character sheet or something? Uh, here, let me check. This is uh, when you reach fourth uh, level. Refresh your shit. What? On what? Because it it, it didn't show level four for me for some reason. So yeah, yeah you're also an ability score. Improvement, or right. you could, or you could choose a feat. What is a feat? Just random, uh, build, uh, like skills or abilities or whatever the fuck. It's a long list. That, um, if you want to go through it, are you in your character sheet settings? Yeah, you can just look at the the screen share. Um. Yeah, if you choose feet, there's another drop down. You can just look through whatever it has to offer, or you could just ability score improvement, where you put in two yeah. points into whatever, whatever you want to do. And then uh, once that's good, just go all the way ahead and finish out the character sheet. All right. <laughs> what? You all good? But I think so. All right. Here, let me refresh. And then double checking your shit. All right, level four. You chose ability score improvement, and you did constitution. And you need you need one more. I can do it for you. Would uh you can do it in constitution or again or whatever. Uh. There you go. Alright, all good. I'll refresh and double check. Wait. Hmm. Did I not put two into charisma? I already had plus three before. Um, oh, is that, oh, is it the, oh, is it the base? It's the base score, right? Yeah, it's the base score, yeah. Okay. You put both in charisma. You, you choose two points. You put them both into charisma? Alright, nice. As expected. <laughs> yeah. Um, so you good then? Yeah, thanks. Alright, uh, Ben, are you good? I'm figuring out my feet. Okay, gotcha. So you already got yours leveled up, you're just yeah. looking for a feet? Okay, and then Angela, that just leaves Angela. Angela, you there? Serge. Yo. I have 20 AC. You I'm have 20, 20 AC, I'm sorry. bro? Oh, I'm sorry. I okay, I'm back. Decks. What did I miss? <laughs> I, have I have 20 decks. You have 20 decks. Holy shit. All right. Angela, I've, uh, everyone's leveling up to four. I'm just doing milestone leveling up now. I don't care. XP's getting annoying. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So okay. level up uh, you level up to four, or do you need help? Got it. No, I got it. I can do it. All right, level up to four. Just make sure you're not missing anything in there. Everyone's been either basically getting like a, uh, at level four an ability score improvement or uh -huh. choose a feat. But you all good? Yep, I'm at level yeah. four now. All right, let me see. Make sure you're not missing anything in there. Um. 
Oh no, it didn't. All right. Uh, it didn't go up, so I'm I'm changing it. Re uh, it didn't. Uh, no, it didn't. Refresh your sheet, and then you should be good. Okay. Because when you're done, uh, and then um, go, uh, make sure you choose either a fee or whatever option the ability score increase, whichever. Or do you know what you're gonna do? Wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. Um. Go back to D and D Beyond. Yeah, and you character sh in the character creator manage your levels and shit. Yeah. You go to that's class. I'm going to that. Okay. All right, so I have it leveled up to four for you. You just got to choose whether you want the ability score improvement or if you're oh, taking the feat. You all good? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'll, I'll choose which one I want. I'm not sure. I don't know which oh. one I want. Oh, you're going to choose? You're going to try and find a feat? <laughs> yeah, I think so. All right, yeah, you know, just go through the list. You can select it. It pops up, uh, uh, you know, in the in the menu and if you don't like it you know you can just cheat, keep changing it or whatever mm -hmm. so you can read more about it so is everyone good at either knowing what they're doing looking for a feat or change their scores yet i'm good yeah. right now ben you're good right now yeah all right Let me see. So check your hit points. Oh yeah, guys, make sure you're your Mac uh, under manage hit points. Make sure it's still overrided to whatever your highest possible HP is. Cause I think we have to go. I think we have to do that every time you guys level up. Make sure you check your max HP in the settings as well. Make sure the value set to. Uh, oh, it says my total. My total possible is fifty six. So go to that. Yeah, to type that in under override it, HP then, Got and then it. just okay. hit apply. Oh, fuck, 56. <laughs> okay. That's pretty good. Uh, Ben, are you going to choose a feat or ability score improvement? A feat. I'm looking through the feats Oh, right Oh, you're now. still looking through it? All right, yeah, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Um, I reset your your max HP. It had to be overridden again. Okay, so you're good right, on that. Thank you. Um, and then yeah, you're just choosing a feat. All right, so Koyan's good. Ben's choosing a feat. Angela's choosing a feat. Ricky did uh the ability score increase. And Wes, you're still looking through a feat. Oh wait, no, you did the ability score increase. Ricky, are you good? Yeah, I'm looking now. You're still looking through feats, right? Yeah. All right. We'll give it another five minutes, guys, and then we'll get started back up. I'll go smoke while you guys look look for your feeds. All right. <coughs> yeah, that shop keep can't stay away from me now. <laughs> <laughs>
Um, Tell her to get it together. <laughs> Shit, I forgot my beer. I'm sorry, guys. One sec. Speaking of forget, let me uh, grab a refill while he's at that. All right. Um, everyone, all good with their sheets? Yeah. No. Yeah. Everybody, get their sheets together. Ricky, you still looking through? Yeah, I'm just going to take the uh, the modifiers. Yeah. Okay. Uh, go thing. go for it and do it. Yeah. How how you do that? <laughs> you just switch it back over. Where it says feeds, you switch it back over to ability scores, and then you'll see more more drop downs for it. Everyone else, good. You guys, make sure you, uh, you've made your changes, and your HP is still set to max, is overridden to the total possible value. Oh yeah, do you uh since we leveled up, do you want us to put um our HP at max again? Uh no, you or guys did take uh whoever took damage still took damage, but just okay. make sure your max your max a HP didn't oh. reset it's or reflecting. anything. All right, that's yeah. what I was just yeah. wanted to make sure make sure. Okay. Ricky, you good? Yeah. All right, you got your changes made? Yeah? Yeah, I'm doing that right now. You said my dexterity and wisdom will be more or less best, right? Yeah, for a monk, yeah. Or you could do two into dex only or two into wisdom only. Whatever you want. What did dexterity do? It, it that that's your modifier you get for like when you swing with your short sword or pun or or sw or get your punches in basically. As a monk, for every modifier point that you have from the base stat points <clears throat> that you have in dex and wisdom, add to your AC. Your dex yeah, adds to your yeah. ability to hit. So if you were, say, at 17 dex and 15 whiz, you could put one on one and each, bring each of those up one modifier level and gain two to your AC and then your hits and everything else. Wait, so you, you sh you're saying you should put uh, one into each? I'm not saying what he should do. I'm just saying that every time one of your base stats becomes an even number, it adds another to your, your modifier. <coughs> oh, okay. Hey, what's, what's mine that now? Can you look at it? <coughs> yeah, I'm looking at it <coughs> right now. <coughs> your dex, your dex is 16 and your wisdom is 16. So you would have to add two to either of those to make something go up by one. Yeah, you should throw it in your dex. Put just just choose both dexterity, and you'll see a modifier go up. All right. This would be a. You got and make sure your max HP didn't change. 
You all good, Ricky? Um, channel for the match H the HP. Shit, hit the button. Wait, it, it's under class, and you just it's on the top, and then you just have to hit the manage HP button. Okay, so I can change my number now. Yeah, where it, uh, yeah, where it says total possible, put that number into override HP. All right, but then I can just finish my page, right? Yeah, you you know you just keep going next until it go brings you back to your sheet. All right, you all good, Ricky? I think so. All right, I'll check. All right. Um. All right, yeah, you're looking good. Everyone's looking good. You're all good. Good to go, guys. Looking good, mom. Looking good. Yes, right. sir. Yes, right. sir. Wes, Angela? Fabulous. Wes? I'm fabulous. <coughs> <coughs> All right. Angela, you good to go? Yep, I'm good. All right, cool, cool. You guys leveled up uh, to four. Let's fucking go. You guys cleared the zombies, cleared the wagon and everything. Um, hop back on the wagon and... Um, and get to the cave. So you ride for like um uh some more time over uh to the cave Yogi uh sent you to. And um it's not um uh you guys go in but the uh the horse uh the horse and wagon can't fit uh is not can't fit in through there. So you guys l leave it out, you know, like hitched just outside the cave. Uh and you guys uh all all roll in. You all good to go? Uh wait, Angela, did you ask your question? Yeah, we're not we don't we don't if we uh, okay. took damage we leave it. Copy that. Onward into the dark cave, which I can see very clearly in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let me bring you guys in. So you guys hitch the horse outside on your way into the cave. Um, you see some broken structures with glowing mushrooms, basically, that illuminates the whole area up. Some of these structures are, are, are broken and collapsed or whatever, and the cave uh, seems pretty empty. It's got like, you know, that little, uh, in the middle of the map, it dives a little bit deep, and the side cliffs are like, uh, what's it called? Uh, let's say they're like uh, 15 feet on both sides, higher, highly ele elevated, and then it just, you know, down into the pit and back up on the other <laughs> side, basically. Um, so, with that being said, uh, what do you guys want to do? Uh, are we supposed to be on a different screen? Oh, right, yeah, my bad. Let me bring you in. I brought myself in, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, right. so, so yeah, like you, I said, you, it's like a little, uh, the pathway in the middle dives deep around like 20 feet, and then, uh -huh. you know, there's all those glowing 
mushrooms around, uh, like, illuminating the place with all these, like, like, uh, broken to fallen structures, uh, surrounding, uh, I mean, throughout the cave. So you're at the entrance door to the, uh, the south side. Okay. So, without, mi without skipping a beat, the talking axe is like, Someone's here! Come out! <laughs> <laughs> Guess we're all gonna ready up real quick. <laughs> Can we flank to the side for high ground? <laughs> So, a child comes out. Oh, oh no, not again. The little boy. Ah, it's got a gun! Bait, stay back! <laughs> <laughs> I quit once, I can't be careful. A boy comes out, he's got pale skin, and he's wielding a crossbow. Um, and he seems pretty annoyed with with you guys and he's like so you guys have been the ones who've been destroying my experiments on the nearby villages it's been it's been hindering my progress and you guys uh need to go it it, it stops here so any of you guys have your last words before we end it here so you're the wee bastard making these zombies eh yeah, and you guys keep killing them. I need them for my experiments. Okay, so who wants to smack him first? I, I raise my hand. <laughs> <laughs> who haven't? Ricky, this is what you've trained for. Um, I want to uh, use intimidation. <laughs> what do you say? Um... <laughs> Where, where um, is the, oh, he's over there. Okay. Um, what do you say, I hey, bro? Say, I want to say, if you even think about firing that crossbow, you're going to regret it. And then, uh, roll, I roll, yeah, roll for intimidation. Yeah. Would we even be what, able is to that, what, is that, that a saving away? throw? No, or, it'll be under no, your no, skills. No. The long yeah, list yeah, of skills. skills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it right here. Okay. He's oh, he's a hundred foot feet away. <laughs> I held it very what? loud. What did he say? <laughs> he fires a crossbow at, at oh, hey, bro. Fuck. <laughs> oh fuck! <laughs> does it does it reach from that far? <laughs> Let's find or out. It, or does it just fall on the it's floor? It's got a range of uh <laughs> range thirty. Uh range is thirty, but get up to one hundred twenty for disadvantage. <laughs> so that's ninety feet at disadvantage. Let's go. I'm using the Euclidean for disadvantage. Ruler. I feel like the Euclidean ruler is more accurate. I'm oh wait! And take oh wait! Shit! I, I'm rolling the wrong thing here. My bad. Um, Serge, what's up? Can I run in front of Hey Bro? Uh, no, nah, it's too late. He he fired that thing. I just gotta roll to see if it hits. I have to roll with disadvantage though, so. Oh, see what's up. Love the minus one HP. <laughs> right. Stop you it. know your your Echoes. campaign's really really making me hate kids. <laughs> Sharkbait, do what you gotta do. I plan to. That's a that's a fifteen to hit with disadvantage. Uh, <laughs> I think that hits, right? Yes. <laughs> All right, rolling for the for the D eight plus five piercing. Fifteen damage. God damn it! Is that half? Oh wait, no, uh, no. I'm sorry. That's ten damage. 
Sorry about that. Okay. Okay. Ow, you so, wee little <laughs> shit! Just fires and pfft, <laughs> lands the shot so, from 90 feet away and just laughs in your face. So it's like, this, <laughs> this ends here. Come on, everyone. There's a fucking arrow in my calf. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, roll for initiative. <laughs> Twenty plus five. Nice. Twelve. All right. Norm, Sharkbait, Koyan, Haybar, and Dragon. All right, cool. Everyone's good to go. They got the rolls in. And then let me get my bad guys Damn, on the board. Koyan, you and I were at the bottom last time. <laughs> How the so, turntable. without uh, Koyan being first, go right for it. See them on a the combat screen, but I don't see them. Oh, I see them. Three zombies come out of uh, come out of hiding. I mean, you know, the axe was already calling it out, and um, there everyone's uh, everyone's ready to go. All right, so I'm gonna run up behind this. Uh partial structure, and then I'm going to try to hide until my next okay. turn. Okay, give me a stealth check. 13. Uh, you're hidden. That, that will be my turn. Alright, Koyan's hidden, runs behind the, the building for cover and hides. First zombie, this one is gonna move here. The next is Dragon. Dragon. Could I creep up right here and be hidden from them? But still peek over and see this guy. Um, that thing is actually not that tall for you. I mean, not that big for you to hide behind. Hmm. We're about over here. Over there? Yeah. Um... I'd Looks say like a structure that was collapsed. Um, I'd say if you move over to to this block over here, you'd be able to uh, you'd be able to uh, try to make a attempt a stealth check. You'd be able to make it. You want to do that? I have a cantrip that I can cast from distance. Okay. Would I be able to cast it, then hide? No. <coughs> cast it and then hide. Wait, unless, like, the cantrip is a, is a bonus action or some shit. What That's cantrip mean. are you thinking of? Sacred Flame. Sacred Flame? Uh, Here, I'm looking it up. No, it takes up an action, so you can either, like, use that action to to try and hide, or just fight, or attempt to fire off the Sacred Flame instead. And then, you know, you can still move around and shit, so. Well, let me, uh, attempt a stealth check. I would like to hide. Okay. Go ahead and stealth check for your action. Yeah, you are hidden as fuck. Hmm. 
Will that be, uh, so you're just gonna hide there? You go for your turn then? Yep. Um. Okay, next up is Norm. Me, Norm. Uh, yo, Sharkbait, do you think, are you gonna, are you gonna run up and just, like, start beating the shit out of them? No, I think I'm gonna let him come. You let him come? I'm trying to get as close to Over your face, or? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> See, I, I was waiting for it. <laughs> <laughs> you turn around and take it on your back. <laughs> yeah, right. Back shots on my back is devious. devious. <laughs> Norm, what you gonna yeah. do? I'm gonna do oh, dude, stealth. A forty feet now. On the rocks. Damn, I can't stealth for shit. <laughs> I got nine. I can only move like a nine. Nah, nah. The kid still knows you're there. <laughs> He's uh, just like, I still see you. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll shoot my crossbow at the the zombie, the blue zombie. I have a direct line of sight. Uh. Uh, which one? Ping one? again? Uh, the blue one. Uh, how do I ping it? Do I just double click it? Yeah, you just double click it. That one, right? Yeah. Uh, Alright. So you get... The... Wait, no, that's not it. Wait, wait, you used your action to stealth. I don't think you can fire off that crossbow as a bonus action. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. True that. Uh, I guess that's all. Okay. Uh, next up, uh, this one is gonna come out. Over here. And then next up is shark bait. Sir, they're on a ledge, right? Or are we all on the same ledge? Uh, they're, they're not on a ledge, they're just like, it's just more higher elevated up where he's at, and at the beginning of where you guys started. And then that center of the map where it looks like there's cliffs on two sides, like, that's kind of like more dipped down a bit, so to speak. Like, the, like the side cliffs are like, are like 20 feet tall. The side of 20 feet tall? Yeah. Okay. I want to run up here. Yell at the little kid like, I wish you would throw some shit at me. Oh, interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see it, buddy. You guys end here. Wait, so you're just going to move there? Are you good then? Hold on, I'm going to... I was looking at my shit earlier. I was thinking. Patiently. That was that right there. I know I want to, like, a patient defense, something like that. Uh, to take a key point to use the dodge action as a bonus action on your turn. Well, if you haven't done anything, you can use your action to set up a dodge. Huh? Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna, yeah. What? I'm just going to... Just gonna stand right there. It'll be more better. All right. Yeah, I'm just in my turn there. Do you want to set up a dodge action then? <clears throat> I want to set up. Yeah. Set up. No, nah, actually, I want to defend the missile. I want to wait that. Wait till that shit comes. Ooh, you want to? Okay, gotcha. 
But that's a uh, that's a reaction. So you can theoretically, like, said, do again. You can do anything else as an action that isn't an attack. Dodge is one of those. And if you set up the dodge action at least, I think the next hit, um, the hit against you for until your next turn is like at a, at a disadvantage or some shit. I forget. I'll look it up. But yeah, right I want to do that then. That All right, you re- hit that All right, cool. You okay. ready up the dodge? So, um, next up, the kid is going to, Yeah. Oh, okay. No, yeah, I'm just uh, reading something. Yeah, I thought I'd be seed for a sec, too. So, the kid is going to... Um, is, is going to cast a spike growth. It has a range of 150 feet, and it creates a 20-foot radius centered on a point within range... Uh, twists and spr- uh, and sprouts hard spikes and thorns. Uh, the area becomes difficult terrain for the duration. When a creature moves into it uh, within the area, it takes uh, 2d4 piercing damage for every 5 feet it travels. So that has a range of 150 feet. Wait, it's a circle or line? It's- He's gonna fuck us up. I right think now. it's a circle. Damn. So it is within range of all of you, and then it creates yeah a twenty foot radius in the ground. Basically, just get like covered in like fucking thorns and vines and like rocks and shit, making it difficult terrain. And anyone that steps in it takes a d two d four piercing damage for every five feet it travels in it. Basically, so I'm going to cast that over. Yeah, it's a 20 foot radius. If I recall, Conan's experience makes our team travel across difficult no. terrain much easier. Or was I meant thinking about the one shot? Or you're, I, thinking, <laughs> you're thinking of the ranger. Oh, uh, yeah. That's 20 feet. So, right here. That is not a 20 feet circle. Good. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah, right there. It's a 20 foot <laughs> radius. Yes, and on a point within range. Wait, is that? I feel like that. I feel like that's really big. Yeah, that's twenty feet. Each square is five feet, right? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Oh uh, my god, it is! Jesus. Yeah, okay. Basically. Yeah. All right. So right there, <laughs> underneath all, all of your guys' feet are all in difficult terrain. So. Uh, this. <laughs> uh, what? I can't dodge it. No. Is already up that dodge? No, no, no. Because it's not a thing. It's like a thing that just happens, like right underneath your feet. It's not necessarily attacking you or anything yet. Because it says uh, when it moves into it or within the area, it takes a two d four piercing damage for every five feet it travels. So we're not taking damage now. No. No. Okay. So, that happens, and, uh... 
God damn. And then it's going to... It's going to ready a dodge. And move... Yeah, it's gonna move. The kid's gonna move. You guys are dead! Yippee! <laughs> <laughs> move right up here. And it's gonna... Yeah, yeah, it's gonna ready, uh, ready a dodge. So, that'll be it for the kid. Next up is Hey Bro. Launch me. Oh. <laughs> Launch me! <laughs> is it 2d4 for every 5 feet? Okay, okay. Wait. Do I have to roll? What do I do? Hmm. You gotta get out that box, man. Go to your right. Get out that get box, out man. Can never eh. get out that box. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. I'll get out. Bye bye. So that was one square. You take a 2d4. Yeah, it's a 2d4 piercing for every five feet it travels. So you were. You were right here, right? Oh, wait. Shit. Hit the wrong thing. I was right here, I think. Yeah. No, yeah. So. so one, two. Yeah, th I'd say this. Is, that was just uh, one square. So two d four piercing goes at you. You take six piercing damage. Getting out of the spiked area. Ow. I'm angerous now. I'm gonna go into a rage. Rage! <laughs> go into rage mode. Screams echo through the cave. God damn it. I'm, I can't do anything from here, though. <laughs> <laughs> you only moved like 10 feet, I think, did you? Yeah, so I'll just... Let's start moving. Run, run, run along Over the edge. here. Run along the edge, drop down, and launch me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can I reach him from here? Can I reach him if from here? If you jump down from there, that's a 20-foot fall. Action no. dash. <laughs> oh. You oh, want to dash it? as an action. I don't think you've used uh, your action yet. You can dash as an action and double your 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 movement speed. Man. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I can, I can cast Feather Fall so you don't take uh, da uh, falling damage. <laughs> then I would still take spike damage. There's spikes down there. <laughs> <laughs> he's, um, really try, he's really trying to get thrown right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry, Norm. Um, I'm gonna use my action and I'm gonna go thirty more feet. Wait, let me see. Wait, okay. thirty more feet. Go for it. Oh, wait, wait, so that's like right there. Okay, bet. <laughs> okay. I'm uh, my spikes turn. on the wall too. Or are they just on the ground? As what? Are there spikes on the wall too, or are they on, on the ground? No, just on the ground. Okay. Alright, uh, I'll end my turn here. Alright, cool. This zombie is gonna go... Here. And then next up is Koyan! Bonus action, man bear pig. Nice! Coin turns into man bear pig. Damn it, wow. More screams oh, echoing hey. throughout a thunderous roar. Lots me. I'll move there by 30 feet, so it's 
two d four damage. Yep, two d four damage. Rolling. Piercing, right? Yeah, three piercing damage. So halved, right? Yep. That's a one. <laughs> And then I'm gonna throw a dagger because he's twenty feet away. Yo, catch your punky man, catch your punky man. All right, give me your to hit. It's a twenty-three. A twenty-three? Yeah, that fucking hits. Seven damage. Sorry, ignore that. Nah. Uh, seven damage. Yep. And that will be my turn. All right, dagger lunges at the uh, right in its fucking torso. The next up is that same zombie is going to move another 20 feet and that slam attack that's a 14 to hit that misses that misses <laughs> Ending its turn. Next up is Dragon. You said how much damage for every square move? It's moved? a two d four for every uh, one moved. I would like to move outward this way. Okay, take a d four. And... I mean two d four. <clears throat> Am I rolling it twice? Yeah. No, I'm rolling it. Oh, you're rolling it. That's eight damage. Damn. Yeah. Ouch. <laughs> That's pain. Got out of there though. Yeah. Do I have enough room to squeeze around here? Yeah, I'd say you can. All right, then I would like to. Move up this way and cast uh, my uh, sacred flame cantrip on the guy in the yellow. Sacred flame? It's a Dex 13. Dex 13, all right, give 60 me a sec. feet of range. Uh, all right, 60 feet of range. You said uh, this one, right? Yep. All right. Um, deck saving throw. Oh, man. That's an 11 for the deck save. Got you, motherfucker. <laughs> Burst into flames. Ouch. <laughs> Two fire damage. The kid's like, whoa, you guys seem to be serious. Let's go. And then I would like to use my bonus action. Yep. Telekinetic shove. That's a, uh, that, that spells, wait, is it a spell? Uh, I believe so. Um... Telekinetic shove. That's dope. That is a bonus action. So, you learn to move things with your mind, granting you the following benefits. Increase your intelligence, wisdom, charisma score by 1 to a maximum of 20. You learn the Mage Hand Cantrip. You can cast it without verbal or somatic components, and you can 
Take a spectral hand visible. If you already know the spell, the range increases by 30 feet when you cast it. It's a uh, spell casting ability is ability increased by this feat. As a bonus action, you can try to telekinetically shove one creature you can see within 30 feet of you when you do so. So the target must succeed on a strength saving throw of a DC 8 plus whatever. Um... So it's a DC 13 for strength. Yep. All right. Who are you casting it on? The guy in the yellow. The same one you hit? Yeah. All right. Strength saving throw. That's a two. <laughs> I would like to <laughs> send him flying to smash into the into the boy. Him. Yeah. So into his square, right? Yep. All right. So what I'm going to go to uh, so the zombie gets knocked back towards the kid, right? The kid rolls a death saving a death saving throw a deck saving throw. Um. And so, um, he just barely dodges, uh, the zombie crawling over, I mean, flying over to him. So let's say, like, he dove out towards over here. Kid's like, whoa, that was pretty smart. <coughs> I'm going to fall for it, man. I'll get you next time, buddy. Yeah, we'll see about that. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> so, you good for your turn, then? That was a dope yep. bonus action, yeah. Uh, next up is Norm. Uh, so you said the wall is not covered in the thorn, right? No, it's not. So I would like to get onto the wall and then climb horizontally 10 feet until I'm out of the thorns. Give me a an acrobatics check for you to attempt to, to make that maneuver. Um... Acrobatics. That's an 11. Nope, you fall right back down into it. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta walk um, it out. <laughs> um... I did say at the DM's option, this is um, the it's a athletics check, but you're the DM, so if it's acrobatics, um, I will just I'll shoot my scorching ray at the little kid. Can it reach that far? A hundred and twenty feet. Oh God! Oh no! <laughs> so that is scorching ray, hit. eighteen to hit. Uh, that misses. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that kid just turn. dodges that ray. <laughs> that's all. Seems like we underestimated the kid. He's like, oh, no, you guys are fucked. <laughs> Next time the zombie is going to go. Over. Here. 
Ending its turn. Then next up is Shark Bait. Right. Is that a full box right there to get out of there? Yeah, you'll take With just one D four stepping can make out. A full box. <laughs> yeah, you'll take one D four stepping out of there. Real, I mean, I, oh, it's one box, so it'll be just one set of two D four for the piercing. Get out of there real quick. Let me get out of here real quick. Fuck. You all good? Are you moving? I'm trying to move. Okay. I'll move. That's six points <laughs> of that's six points of piercing damage. Do you need me to do it for you? Yeah, can you do that? Gotcha. Will we be flanking them if we go here? Wait, give me a sec. I'm changing your your thing right now. Six Yo, Ben, you hit piercing. the yellow dude, right? Yeah. I'm gonna be close to that little boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you get hey, um... yo. <laughs> I mean, I we got him, boy. That is how we we got him. <laughs> what are you trying to do, Ricky? All right. First thing ain't. What? Ricky. You hear me? That's Rick Diddy to yeah. you. You hear me, right? All yeah, right. I can hear you now. What's up? Okay. I'm going to hit him. With my own arm strike. Are, are my arms still out? It said 10 minutes. No, nah, it's been a while because back at the road. Okay. All right, so I'm going to hit him with my own arm strike. You're going to hit the orange one? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, um, but was that, was that, were we flanking? Or no. No, that's not flanking. But the 10 hits, so go ahead, roll your damage. Bludgeting one hitter four. All right, four damage. Bonus action. Luria blows. A hit. Yeah, that definitely hits. Roll your damage. Seven, six. I get another action and a bonus um, action, right? Six damage taken. So, um, no, uh, you get one more punch in because you feel all your blows. Because that's your bonus action. You use blurry of uh, blurry of flows to uh, to uh, <laughs> to hit to hit two more uh, two more times on arm strike. So yeah, go ahead, get one more in. That misses. No, that hits. Word. Yeah. Five. Five damage. Hear a loud crack from the zombie and then it just turns to you. 
Will that be it for your turn? That's your action and bonus action. Uh, All good then? Uh, can we, I can already up your dash action, right? Uh, no, because you already used up your action and a bonus action. Used up your action to punch and bonus action for two punches. Uh, all good then? What's left is your movement, basically, unless you just want to stay there. Uh, then I'll be, I'll be, if I get closer to... Yeah, no, I'm going. I don't want to get an opportunity to attack. All right, you good then? Matter of fact, yeah. All right, so next up, the kid. Um. All right, so <clears throat> kid weaves the si weaves some signs. <laughs> Um, and a and a and a cast whole person. So choose a humanoid that you can see within range. The target must succeed on a wisdom a saving throw or be paralyzed for the duration. Um, at the end of each turn, uh, each of its turns, the target can make another wisdom saving throw. On success, the spell ends on the target. So that kid is going to target Man Bear Pig because it's scary looking as fuck. So, <laughs> Koyan, that's a wisdom saving throw. Nineteen. Uh, yeah, that succeeds. <laughs> so, never mind. Um, <laughs> it's gonna. It's going to use a bonus action to ready up a dodge. Yeah, it's going to use its bonus action to set up a dodge. And then move. Mm -hmm. hmm. Here. Oh yeah, this goes away because yeah. Um so the cable and its turned there ready to dodge. Next up is Habra. All right. Oh man, why did I go up here? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Man, how much fall damage will I take? Let me look that up real quick, though. Yeah. Okay. Technically, okay. it's bludgeoning. I am yeah, raging. It's bludgeoning. <laughs> what if I yeah, land on this have, mushroom right here? <laughs> I have feather fall too. I can slow your your fall without damage, basically. <clears throat> ah. I'm going to use it as a reaction. Ah. Super How far landing. can I jump? Superhero <laughs> landing. <laughs> Fuck, where is it? Nom, nom, nom. How would I know how f how far I jump? 
Can I um, land on a zombie? <laughs> <laughs> Can I, I jump can't and find land on this guy? <laughs> How come I can't find falling damage? What the fuck? It's 1d6 per 10 feet. Yeah, I was trying to look that up. My bad. 1d6 per 10 feet? Yeah. Alright, so... Yeah, 2d6s of falling damage is 20 feet. I bet I'm a jump. <laughs> I cast Featherfall as a reaction. <laughs> so it just reduces it, right? I gotta give you what she's about what, what she's about to take, right? So uh, let's see. Uh, up to, uh, creature descent slows to sixty feet per second. Per round until spell ends. If the creature lands before the spell ends, it takes no falling damage and can land on its feet. And the spell ends for that creature. So, yeah. Nice. That then, yeah, she makes it down safely. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Superhero okay, landing. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you moved. F you. I'd say you moved like five square, just one square basically. So you still got whatever movement you got left. Okay. I want to attack him then. <laughs> 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 just, just, An angry just jump zombie. down, plummet twenty feet, yeah. saved by saved by Norm's featherfall, rushes up to a zombie, and swings the talking great axe. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, give it yeah. you to hit. That hits. Eight. Eight damage, because you're raging as fuck. All right, let's go. And I'm Eight. also, as a bonus action, going to go into a frenzy. Hells yeah, let's go. Okay. So, next up is... This zombie is going to move... Here and it's gonna get flank a flank on shark bait and and with a slam attack with advantage. That's a twenty two to hit. Where are you, shark bait? Oh yeah, yeah, that hits, and... That's a... Three points of bludgeoning damage onto shark bait. Let me do it for you? I got it. You got it? All right, three points of bludgeoning damage. You all good? Okay. All right. Um, then back up to Koyan. Gonna flank this guy. <clears throat> yep. Roll with advantage. Twenty-one to hit. Yup. Upload. 11 damage. 11 damage rolls through. I look at the little kid. I'm like, what's your name? You're able to, sl uh, uh, to slice the zombie's throat open and it collapses. Sweet. After the zombie falls in front of me, I look at the little boy and I'm like, what's your name? <laughs> uh, my name's Ip. 
And that's all you're going to know before you die. I'm going to walk right here. Go, fuck you, Ip. And I'm going to swing with the other rapier. That'll yeah, be with a disadvantage because they readied up a dodge. 15 minutes. So, 15 misses. No oh, shit. God, this is 18 to hit. <laughs> That'll be my turn. You're getting left. It's just best. like, it's nice try, but 30. nope. <laughs> <laughs> this place isn't yours anymore. Next up is Dragon. I would like to run up to it. Also say fuck you to it. <laughs> and then use my inflict wounds spell. Okay. Which is uh, touch, so I'm going to touch it. In a non-sexual <laughs> manner. <of course. laughs> I have to make sure to clarify that. <laughs> Actually, I would like to cast it in my second level. Oh? It's a uh, necrotic 3d10 damage. Inflict wounds, you're casting it at the second level? Make a melee attack spell against. Dude, is it two hit component to, uh, to it? I thought you just had to touch them. Uh, no, there. It looks like there is a to hit. Yeah, because of flinted wounds. Nice yeah, it's a plus more. five. So yeah, that misses. That's wild. Yeah. And then I would like to use my bonus action. Yeah. Spiritual weapon. Okay. I will create a large axe locked up right behind Ip. And then it allows me to make a melee attack. Whoa, what? <laughs> So, yeah. So a specter, ghost-like type axe shows up right behind the Ip, is what you're saying? He swings yep. with a 16 to hit? That misses. Oh, my God. Ip, you're a lucky son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, my turn. <laughs> Actually, mm. before I end my turn, can I move back right here? Um, I will do an opportunity attack. It will do Never an mind. opportunity attack if you do so. I'll be chilling right in front of him. <laughs> yes, <sir>. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that'll be it. Yeah. Norm. Porch. I, I whisper discordant melody that only the the enemy boy in here, racking it with terrible pain. He hears the ghostly voice come out of nowhere. La 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 <laughs> Domain <laughs> expansion. He's got to survive a wisdom 13 throw. What? <laughs> yes. All right, not, wisdom, uh, wis yes. Wisdom saving throw? Yes. All right, let's see here. That's an uh an eleven. Oh what? Oh wait, no, I'm sorry. That's a that's a fourteen. You got a fourteen? Yeah. Uh, oh no, I'm sorry. Thirteen. You have a thirteen? Does that yeah. does that mean you pass or no? Don't pass. What was the DC? Thirteen. Oh yeah, I just barely passed that shit. 
Okay, so... This fucking I'm... Ip Man. Hold on. <laughs> Ip Man. <laughs> <laughs> on successful save, target takes half as much damage. Troll. Troll. Nine damage. Oh my god, that was an insanely good roll, though. <laughs> Not even. <laughs> Four D6s, bro? Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, I need to cast. Slot. And la 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 la. Hold on, that's, that was my action. And then, also, did that giant field of spikes disappear? Yeah, it's gone. Okay, cool. I will walk 25 feet this way oh. this way so I'm more closer in, in eyesight of the guy and also say fuck you Ip and end my turn <laughs> fuck you Ip <laughs> <laughs> fuck you too buddy <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this zombie is going to hmm. I need to step away for five minutes, but I'll be back. Okay. Well, let's talk about touching the board. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this one right here is going to swing back at hey bro with the slam attack. That's uh that's a eighteen to hit. That hits. Fuck. So that'll be that'll be seven points of bludgeoning, half because you're raging. So that brings it down to three. So three. Yeah, three bludgeoning damage. It's our. Uh, it's it. ha yeah. Then next up is shark bait. <laughs> Yep, okay. What I'm gonna do is. This one's still alive, right? Which one? This Blue one. one. Yeah. That one? Yeah. Uh. I haven't thrown. <laughs> <coughs> I can grab him and throw him, can I? You could attempt a shove. It will be. It will take up your action, and all right. And Wes is making me do a plank and a push up. Um. <laughs> yeah. So. Wes, go back to the D and D screen. Oh. There you go. <laughs> um, Alrighty. So what we're gonna do is it'll be it'll use up your action. It'll be like ath athletic checks versus athletics checks, and then we'll see if you can do it. And if not, you can try and knock him back like five feet. Nah, I forget. I'm just gonna un un strike him. More convenient. All right, okay. roll to hit. Thirteen that hits. Oh, you're streaming my screen. <laughs> yeah. Uh, four bludgeoning damage with the fist. 
Uh, mm-hmm. bonus action. That would be we call the glory of blows. Oh, matter of fact, that'll be your final key point right there. Then I won't do that. I'll, I'll take out my arms and astral self. Then that 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 uses up a key point as well. Yeah, but I'd rather have my arms out. Yeah, but to get but yeah, but to get your arms out uses up a key point. Yeah, so I, I can use the last one, right? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna do that then. Where's my key points at? All right, so that'll be your final key point. And then you bring out your your astral arms. So dexterity. So each creature of your choice you can see within ten feet. So that'll be you. I'm back. Yeah, you can do Just that blue one. Or Each creature of your choice, yeah. Yeah, the one right next to you, and then... Yeah, that's about it. Just the one right next to you is in range. And then do that there. So, deck saving throw, 12. DC 12, right? <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah, Dex 12. That's a 16. Can you hear me? Yep, that's a 16. It saves. Bitch. <laughs> All right. That's that, right? Yeah, that's Do your I bonus that? action. You got your movement left, if anything. What do you want to do? Yeah, I'm going to stay right here. Because I can't. For the hit right now. Can I? No. Yeah. I'll stay right there. Okay. Next up. The kid is going to move. Hmm. How do I want to do this? I'm back at like 3. 40, 345. And I ended up going on my last break at 4. 30. <laughs> Um, it's going to run over here. Wait, it's going to move five. No, no. Yeah. Five and fifteen twenty. Uh that provokes an attack of opportunity on on Dragon, so give me your to hit. Oh whoops, sorry. Not a weapon, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't mean to, sorry. Oh good. My to hit? Yeah, Back you're to hit with whatever weapon you got. Oh, um... Uh, 16 to hit. That misses. Damn. And then... It's like, eh, eh, and then cast, weave some more signs to cast another spell. A wave of thunderous force sweeps out from you. Each creature in a 15-foot cube originating from you must make a constitution saving throw. So, where's the 15-foot cube? It's my move. I'm going that 20. Nat 20? Shit. <laughs> Total 
Those are 15. But... Hey. There you go. Thank you. Um, so, yeah, that'll be Koyin saves and Shark Bay. I need you to roll con save, Constitution saving. Wait, is it a square? Yeah. Where Thunder is a square. <laughs> <laughs> uh, shark bait. Ricky. Ricky. the bathroom, my bad. I gotta use the bathroom. Constitution saving throw. Yo, yo, you hear me? Yeah. yeah. It casts Thunder Wave. It's attempting to knock you guys back. I need you to, yeah, con save. 21. Okay. 21. Fuck you, it, man. Um, yeah, you both save. So. You take half as much of a 2d8 and you don't get pushed. So. I'm sorry, it's a 3d8. Does the, um. Is that, that's all just for the enemies, right? Not. But that nigga's not even in it. <laughs> yup. <laughs> that's uh That's fourteen damage halved. You both take seven points of thunder damage. Ricky, you got it? Yeah. I get it. Yep, seven points of thunder damage to both of you. And then the kid will end his turn. <laughs> So, all right, Wes wants me to do a plank and, and a push-up. So if you guys want to strategize real quick, go for it, and then we'll get into Hey Bro's turn, all right? <laughs> okay, good, because I have to use the restroom anyway. <laughs> Bye! Okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. I need you to fix my suit. I put 77 and put a 7. <laughs> no, you can kill self. Please. <laughs> <laughs> Just He's drops begging dead. over it. <laughs> He's begging. He needs it. <laughs> so I think you're at 24, right? <laughs> yeah. I think I can that's, go over here. That's hilarious, bro. <laughs> yeah, you're at 24, right? And then I'm gonna. All right. So first, let's bring you back to life. And then take set. I'll do the seven damage for you. Yeah, I just put it next to seven. <laughs> Seventy-seven damage. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna do that plank and push up real quick. Headphones off. Gentlemen. And singular woman, what are we gonna do here? Damn. Beat the shit out of him. I need to take some a health potion. I haven't even Something. gotten a fucking hit on him, man. Oh motherfucker. Is he in the middle of all of us? Yeah. But there's still oh, two zombies alive. I'm gonna attack this zombie on my side then. Yeah, can we, can we, can I heal? Or can you heal us? Can I take a potion while I'm here? Is that a free action? Be your action or bonus action. Comfy. What to do? You gotta kill that. Um, 
Well, she gonna try to hit this dude right here in the left. They're gonna try to go for the little dude. Can we all like run and try to hit ready up like, and attack on him? Let's not kill the kid because we need information. <laughs> Or no, we, he's like, provoked us enough. We gotta kill him. <laughs> no. Do sort of do it the information. <sighs> oh god. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> hey bro, you're dead. Oh god, okay. <laughs> All right. I'm going to attack the zombie right here. All right. You got flanking, so that's with the advantage. Mm -hmm. I love you. I love you, too. Nat 20. Nat 20? Nice, sir. So, what is it? it? It's a d12 plus what? Just roll a regular, uh, make it a custom roll. Oh, wait, okay, make it a, how do I do that? What do I do? Uh, select your dice to make it a custom roll. It's like, select a d12. And then you can just roll it. Okay. So four plus your modifier. Uh, from my hit. Yeah, for your hit. Plus, what's your plus? Plus six. Plus six to. Oh my god! All right. <laughs> yeah. So that's ten damage doubled, making it twenty. Plus uh, for range. <laughs> plus, plus two for range. Oh yeah, so twenty-two oh, damage onto <laughs> this poor zombie. <laughs> 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 so wait no i'm sorry it's plus four not six plus four I was all right 22 uh, so back down to 20 16, okay. 18. sorry sorry <laughs> so you just completely chop its head off clean it was a clean fucking slice Oh my god, there's a kitten outside my house. <laughs> okay. And that one um, drops. Okay, cool. Dead. Um Well And then I wanna move and can uh uh where the hell is the child? Where's the kid? Right here. Okay. Can I uh try to grapple the child and hold them in place that would take up an action which you already used to swing uh -huh. okay then never mind yeah okay okay, okay. all right then he's lucky <laughs> <laughs> then i will end my turn all right next up the zombie is going to move here Whoops, not there. Here. And then swing at shark bait with the slam attack. That misses, so then uh next up is Koyan. Well, Surge, yes. since he's been casting spells, I'm going to assume yeah. he's a mage of some sort, right? Uh, you can roll an insight check. I got butter. But, yeah. but yes, you do see the, the kid has casted some spells so far. Indeed. <clears throat> Have I noticed him holding anything? Like... A spell focus. Like a if he spell grabbed a necklace or held an orb or a wand or anything while well, he's been doing this. No, he he has the no he has the crossbow put away when he ran up to you guys 
and um, uh, he's got a short sword in his hand. Gruffus says, "That's what she says." <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna swing with the rapier with advantage. Damn straight. Uh, seventeen to hit. That misses. Offhand attack. With advantage. Nat 20. That hits. Roll your damage. Double it. Oh, fuck me. Oh, man. 2, 8, 16. 16 damage. 16 damage? I have a plus six to my damage. Well, that'd be seven, that'd be 14. Sorry. Um, 14 right. damage. Yeah, I gotcha. So. All right. Kid took a good hit. It was like, oh, you guys are serious. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't been fucking around. And then... <laughs> I'll use my movement to move over to here. Okay. All good? Yep. Next up is Dragon. Hmm. I'm figuring it out right now. Two spots to go to to catch him in a in a predicament. I'm gonna run up to him and <coughs> use the inflict <coughs> wounds level one this time. Okay. And hope for it to hit. So you get advantage for being flanked? Um. Yeah, that yeah, that'd be advantage. It's a melee spell. It's, yeah, yeah, it's a to hit. It's a melee. Yeah, that's with advantage. Roll another. Uh, roll it again. Oh, did I do it wrong? I should have rolled no, it again. No, no. Um, no. Yeah, you're good. That one hits. So it's three d ten necrotic. Thirteen damage. Okay. All right. That kid definitely felt that. It was like, ah! <laughs> you're ruining everything. And then I end my turn. Next up is Norm. <laughs> I cast dissonant whispers again. I said, fuck you, hip. Fuck <laughs> you. You will submit. <laughs> and so you gotta do wisdom 13 saving throw. Wisdom? Yes. That's a 19. Damn. Uh, it takes six damage. Six damage? Duh. Alright, six damage taken. And, uh, no, 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 no. Um. I shall cast my bardic inspiration upon man bear pig. Fuck that now, boy up. <laughs> non textually. <laughs> so, uh, Koyan gets a bardic inspiration die. What is it? A D6? D6. All right. There you go. 
inspires Koyan on the battlefield. Will that be for your turn? You. Yeah, that is all. Next up is Sharkbait. All right, can I take a potion? You can, you can do it as a bonus action, yeah. All right, so... Okay, so I'm going to hit this little kid. Lethally. Lethally. <laughs> Lethally. <laughs> I'm going to roll. Are you going to roll? There you go. The 12 misses. Sharkbait's just used to being lethal. <laughs> All right, and I'm taking my potion. Inventory. That'll be a 2d4 plus 2 for the Potion of Healing. You make, you make it a custom roll, just pick 2d4s, be good. Ricky! Oh, there you go. Did you get it? Yeah, I'm seeing it. So, you heal 10, 10 HP. Do you need me to do it for you? Yeah, I got it. You got it? Alright, yeah, you heal for 10, uh, 10 hit points. So good shit. Uh, so that just leaves you with your movement, unless you're good there. Hmm. You were cutting out. You were cutting out. Yo. Yo, can you hear us? Yeah, I can hear you. You can hear me? Yes, we can hear you now. All right. Can that you leaves your me? movement. Yes, we can hear you. Yes. That, um... Says failure. Says death saving throws. I need to do that. Wait, what? My death no, you shouldn't, throws? no, you shouldn't be in death saves right now. Here, let me, I'm opening up your sheet. But, No, yeah. Heal 10 HP. I'm gonna do it for you, alright? Yeah, I'm, re I'm refreshing now. Okay. That's 10 HP. I healed you up. Um, is that it for your turn, then? Yeah, and I wanna move. Alright. So that leaves up with Ip. Ip is going to um So, okay, okay. This is what I'm going to do. Going, the kid's going to weave another sign and cast Earth Tremor. So, you cause a tremor in the ground within range, 10 feet. Uh, each creature other than you in that area must make a dexterity saving throw DC 15. On a fail, the creature takes D6 bludgeoning damage and is knocked prone. 15. 15? Damn, alright. So you save. That's a plus 7 to my save, man. Alright. So, I also need Koyan, I mean, not, not Koyan, Sharkbait and uh, Dragon to to give me a uh, 
A dex saving throw. Shark bait, dex saving throw, not a not a dex check. Two horrors. Alright. So shark bait with the Sorry, sorry, the sorry, seven. sorry, sorry, sorry. And then yeah, do deck save dragon. There we go. Eight. So Koyan fail uh succeeds. Shark bait and dragon fail. So Does your monster get it too? No, other than me. Okay. Basically just stomps the ground like Doo! and then just <laughs> the ground fucking tremors. And um, the guys that fail take a d6 budgeting damage, and you guys are knocked prone. So oh, yeah, let me roll. Laugh. Let me roll the damage out real quick. Okay. Um... Why is it taking forever to load? I missed it. Fuck. That's gonna be four bludgeoning damage to the both of you guys, and you guys are knocked prone. So, well, I think it takes, like, half your movement to get up or something. Yeah. Except four, right? It's not an action, though? <laughs> well, no, it, uses, it uses your movement. Yeah, yeah, it uses your okay. movement to get up. <clears throat> and then every melee attack against you has advantage. I think it's yeah, but if you most times you can tell me before get it on lunch. Okay. So prone and oh. yeah. It's not <clears> working. <throat> no, it guides me. It's not like the whole thing. I thought it was cool. All right, so, um, All right, it's going to use a, a bonus action to ready up a dodge. No, it's going to... to disengage for its bonus action. And move over uh move over here and take a wait wait. No yeah, it's just gonna move it back because I already used uh his action. So next up is Hey bro. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna non lethally smack the boy. Non lethally smack the boy? <laughs> yes, non lethally. I'm not trying to kill him. I want info. But I will. Does it that hit? misses. <laughs> Does that miss? Okay, well, I have a. Because I'm also still in rage and a frenzy, I can. Do it again. 
<laughs> that also misses. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Kids dodging, <laughs> jumping through these massive axe swings. God damn it! <laughs> Is that it? Yeah, but now I, I, my rage ends because I didn't make any do any damage. Yeah. <laughs> so okay. all good then for your turn. Yes, I guess. All right. Next up, uh, fuck it. Someone just fucking kill the kid. This zombie is gonna take a swing at uh, at Norm. So the slam attack goes in. Let's see. That's a nine to hit. That misses. Yarp. So, yeah, that's going to end its turn, and then back up to Koyan. We're moving right up here. Probably guess what's going to happen. We'll go non-lethal. <laughs> Yes, with advantage. That misses. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna do it again. <laughs> that twenty. Okay, that hits. <laughs> nice. You can do it. Kill him. <laughs> that will be thirteen times two, twenty-six. Points of piercing damage, not lethal. 26? <laughs> well, 7 plus 6 is 13 times 2. <laughs> Tw 26 non lethal piercing damage. <laughs> that kid just spits out blood. God! Taking a massive hit. <laughs> <laughs> I look him in the eyes and I just silently flip him off with my free hand. <laughs> Screw you! <laughs> Is that it? I'm going to move right there with my last movement. Gotcha. Next up is Dragon. Cool. I would like to the fuck <clears throat> out of him. <laughs> Not really. Not really. <laughs> 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 what are you doing? Mm. What are you disturbing? What? My name's like a last dildo in your freezer. Oh, 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 guys, 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 guys. <laughs> Dragon, you there? Yeah. I'm trying to <laughs> think what I want to do here. Yeah. I'm going to grab my soda. You heard that? I try not to. Just trying first. So I would like to cast my mm -hmm. mage hand cantrip. I don't even know what kind of soda. You okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, spectral floating hand appears at a point you choose within range, which will oh, be yeah. deep. Yeah. And that was like a big time. That's to manipulate an object. I would like to have my hand hold on to Eep so he can't move. You want to grapple him? Yeah. Uh, so that's a that's a strength check for your action, right? Yeah. All right. Um. Yeah, give me your your athletics check. I'll contest it. You got sixteen. I'm rolling. So, the kid 
just manages to slip out your your attempted uh uh grapple basically just barely like as you were closing in he just swoop you know out why the, told, you know why I told the black why because the trauma because like the black thing is blood that's trapped inside blood. how do you know because I researched last night um I would like to then use my bonus action, telekinetic shove. Okay, nice. That's a, uh, I got a roll for save, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, which save is it? Strength saving. Strength saving throw? Um, yeah, it failed. The kid failed. All right, then I end my turn. No, I mean, it failed the saving throw. Oh, oh, oh. yeah. I would like him to get pushed back and smack into Koyan. Into Koyan? Yeah. Uh, Koyan, make a deck save. <laughs> 21. Yeah, you, you, may, <laughs> you may should just dodge out of it. <laughs> so I move off to the side? Yeah, you can move off to the side real quick. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, it's so knock pack five or ten feet? I forget. Five. Five? All right. Right there, then. Um, so, yeah. Is that it? Yep. He goes, yeah. Knocks the kid back. Koyan dodges. Next up is Norm. Oh, shit. Sorry. Why is the kid um, over there? Norm, uh, yeah. What are you doing? I am... Uh, um, I'm a casting a spell, which the little boy, wait, the little boy, is he supposed to die? Is that why we were doing non-lethal? I can't hear Wes. Hello? Are you muted? I hear you. I hear you. Oh. Can you hear me? Yeah, no, dude. What was your okay. question, uh, Wes? Uh, is he is the little boy close to that? Is that what we're non child non lethal slap him to unconsciousness? Oh, he won answers. Yes, but like, how how bloody up is he? Because like, I, I kind of like missed that part. Kid's been bleak, coughing up blood profusely. Okay, can I non lethally cast? Thunderstorm. Oh god. <laughs> Thunderwave. <laughs> Not lethally cast Thunderwave. <laughs> you gotta turn them black. Bro. No, I think I think non lethal is for melee only. Yeah. Okay. Fine. <laughs> fine, fine. I cast Thunderwave. <laughs> <laughs> I cast I cast fireball. Non lethal. <laughs> Um, Power word kill. What I want. Power word kill. <laughs> can I do that not lethal? Not. Oh yeah, I also can have. I also have to cast it like on myself. So there you go. I'll cast on the wave on myself and hit the zombie there. It's got oh, okay, survive. So... Thirteen Constitution saving throw. Okay, let's see what's up. 11 on fail, 5 on save, and he gets thrown back blah, 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 10 feet. That's uh, a 19 for the, con for the con save. God damn it. All right, that's, so that's a 5, five damage. Five, five damage. Five. Doesn't Very get knocked rookie. back. Yeah. Ah! It's for me. Uh, and then I'll move 
a key. And that's it. All right. Next up is shark bait. Alrighty. All right. We still got that one zombie left, ain't? Yeah, right below you. Yeah, the one right next to you. I'll give him a quick one too. Real quick. Yeah, just because I say it, don't mean it's gonna happen. But bam, um, strike. And this fella here, fuck. Yo, catch your pumpkin, man. Catch That's, your uh, that man. hits? Yeah, yeah, that hits. And five. Five damage taken. Stop still standing. All right. My bonus action. Whoa. Ah. Uh. That's critical. Oh, yeah, that hits. Go for it. Another five. Five damage. Still standing. Motherfucker. And I get attacked one more time, right? No, nah, yeah. You used up your key all your key points for the flurry. All right. You good? Yep. Two solid hit decks on the on the fucking zombie getting hurt up. Now next for the kid. Ip is going to He's going to Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Ip is gonna swing down on Koyam with the short sword. That's a 13 to hit. That misses. Then it's going to use uh, a uh, bonus action to throw an unarmed strike. Okay. The paper's right there. Second drawer. Right. Oh, Jesus. That's an 11 that misses. <laughs> <laughs> And is going to move right here. <laughs> Next up is Haybra. Little motherfucker right. running away. But all right, come here, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> grapple him. Well, do I have to do a strength check? Yeah, it'll be uh, your athletics, and uh, the kid will contest it. Athletics? Yeah. Okay. All right, Norm, I think it's time to start playing the banjo. <laughs> oh, I got a nat 20. <laughs> a nat 20? Oh, oh jeez. Oh, no! <laughs> Yeah, that all. Yeah, you got the kid grappled. Damn right, It's like, Gobi! You guys are dead! Nah, I got you, little boy! <laughs> <laughs> so. The boy, you squirm, the tighter I'll grab you. <laughs> so, at speed becomes zero, it can't benefit from any bonus to its speed. The condition ends with the grappler is incapacitated. The condition also ends in effect, removes the grapple creature from e reach. Okay, I gotcha, gotcha. So yeah, it's fucking grappled. Uh, you all good, hey, bro? Yep, I got a hold of him. <laughs> all right, next up is the zombie's gonna make a slam attack on shark bait.
That's a nat 20. That's yeah. crit. Yeah. <laughs> Shark bait, you take ten points of bludgeoning damage. We'll see. Yeah, ten that points hurt. of bludgeoning damage. Yeah. <laughs> do you mean do your that HP hurt. or are you good? I already did it. All right. Uh, next up is Koyan. So, he's grappled right now, right? Yes. Can, can I put manacles on him? You want to put manacles on him? I have them in my inventory. Okay. <laughs> you could, you could attempt to? I mean, like, I guess he's restrained, so, like, I'll give you advantage on, like, a slide of hand check, I guess. <laughs> okay. Hold on, I would use my Bardic Inspiration to add a 6 to the 14 to make that 27. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Thank you, Norm. <laughs> You're welcome. So, now the kid is restrained. And these aren't the fuzzy ones, either. <laughs> I, I would really hope not. Yep. Yo. Yo. So it's grappled and restrained now. Will that be it for your turn, Koyan? I'm gonna look at it and be like, just stay down. Do the right thing. It's like, no, you guys won't get away with this! Not tell us. Huh? Huh? No, we still got one more zombie. <laughs> you better kill me! I'm I gonna move right there in case Habra has to do anything she has advantage. <laughs> so you go with your turn? Yeah. Dragon? I mean, he's, he's restrained, <clears throat> he's grappled, and he, he's basically fucked. I'm gonna run up to this guy and hit him with uh, inflict wounds of the first level. So it's it's a hit, right? Yeah. Ages to load that die for me. We're still loading for me. What the fuck? Yeah. What does it say? Fifteen. The fifteen. Uh, wait. You're hitting the kid or the zombie? It's the zombie. Uh, yeah, that hits. Oh my god. Wait, that's a level one spell? God damn it. <laughs> yeah, dude! <laughs> How much is level two? Four D tens? Uh, yeah, it's four D tens. Good day. So that zombie just gets incinerated <laughs> through the thunderous boom. <laughs> that just leaves the kid. And I run up to go and surround the kid as well. All good? Oh, I was uh, proned. So half movement. Yeah. So five. 
And then I have to stay down here. I can't surround the kid. Yeah, now I'm all good. All right. Next up is Norm. <clears throat> uh, well, what are we supposed to do? I, like, it's, we got him grappled. Yeah, we are, are we him. still in combat? <laughs> yeah. That kid's not not giving up. All right. Well, guys, grab the canvas sack from my bag and just put it over his head. Can I? Hmm. Okay. Can Can I? Can I like try? To, can I like talk? To, c deceive the kid. Try to say something to him. What do you want to like, say to him? Hey, like, hey, look, look, look. Just want to ask you a few questions, and then we'll let you go. You know, we're only getting paid to like find out what's going on, not anything else. And then you can do your thing again. Give me a persuasion check. Persuasion check. Son of a ten. <laughs> She's like, fuck you, no! Oh, if you don't kill me right now, it's gonna be bad! Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Well, shark bait, it's a good thing your turn's next. <laughs> yeah, <if you're> <laughs> I cast Vicious Mockery. <clears throat> yes, it's a 5 of 13 with some saving throw. Wait, is that an action or a bonus action? Can you use your action to try Ooh. and talk the kid down? That's that's an action? Okay. okay. Yeah. Never mind. I couldn't use that as a bonus action? The talking? No, that would be an action. Okay. Oh, wait. Let me, let me move my champ, uh, person real quick. Hold on. I want to move him closer. Uh... 25 feet. Okay. Yeah, I got All good? Feet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so All right. What's up? The manacles are a DC 20 dex to get out of them or DC 20 strength to break them. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So, so he can't use his hands to cast spells right now. Really? <laughs> you said he didn't have a focus. I found a new way to take away his spell casting. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, Norm, you good then? Yeah. Shark bait. You throwing a dart? <laughs> Yo, what are you doing? Yo, you got yourself muted, I think. Yeah, my bad. So, you're throwing, throwing a, dart a dart for an action? What? You're just gonna... No! <laughs> <laughs> no! Well, that nine misses, and then you can't throw a second okay. dart, but you can run up and punch the kid if you want. <laughs> nope, I'm going to throw a dart at him. You can't throw a dart again. The only thing you can do for a bonus action is to punch, basically. Or whatever the fuck, I think. Hey, fuck. There is. Damn. Can't run up. Can I run up for him? Am I yeah, you can him? run up. Where you at? Look, let's not kill the kid, please. Wait, so... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you hey, can make it hey, to him. What are you going to do? Ah, oh, shit. Hey, kid. I'm going to give you one more time to get... No, I'm not. Fucking three. Give you one more time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that eight misses. So, one more time, right? Nope, that was your bonus action. That's it. Fucking motherfucker, you. 
So the kid is going to try and break out the lock. Uh, what did you say it was? I can use strength DC, or... DC 20 strength or dex. Strength also or great. dex. He's still grappled. That's a 20. A dirty 20. Catch your Pokemon! Catch your Pokemon! So the kid breaks free of the restraints, right? <laughs> but he's grappled. Oh yeah, he's still grappled, so... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, he, used, he used his action to break out of those. Yeah. And... He may have broke the cuffs, but I still got him. Oh. It's gonna use Second Wind as a bonus action to heal itself up real quick. It's a... Gross. It's a 1d10. Okay. <laughs> um. Uh, next up is Hey Bra. Um. Just like <laughs> you, just Pokemon? better kill me. <laughs> uh. I'm gonna use intimidation and aggressively shake him till he gives up. <laughs> You want it to get they get the kid to stop fighting you, basically. Yes, by aggressively shaking him. <laughs> <laughs> Give me uh, an intimidation check. Hey, since I I can use something as a reaction. Could I give her aid if I burn my blood maledict to make him go blind during this? Yeah. Yeah, I'll burn my blood maledict and I'll, I'll forgo the minus 1d4 to his attack hit just so that he goes blind and is scared more. Oh, God. <laughs> so, so the, do I roll with advantage? Yeah. Roll intimidation with advantage, and you said the kid's blind now? Yeah, for one turn, his eyes go pitch black and he can't see anything. I can't see! I can't see! <laughs> Um, that's a taste of what death is gonna be like. The kid's just like, ah, oh, fuck you! Damn it! You better kill me! <laughs> Should I just throw him? <laughs> no, we can still, we can okay. still have fun. We can have fun. <sighs> Alright, so the intimidation didn't work, I'm guessing, so... Yeah, no. Let me at him! Let me at him! <laughs> you all good, okay. then? Yeah, I guess so. Alright, Koyan? Alright, non-lethally, I'm going to swing with my bear claw. To smack up this kid. Sorry, advantage. Yep, with advantage. 19 to hit. 19 hits. That'll be 12 non lethal damage. 12 non. <laughs> More blood being spat out. <laughs> I can do this all night. You should just shut up and answer our questions. And I cock back my other arm, ready to swing again. <laughs> the kid's just like, do it! Do it now! <laughs> That's another 19 to hit. 
<laughs> yeah, that hits. <laughs> non-lethal. Uh, nine more non-lethal damage. Nine more non-lethal damage. Yeah. Let's do it! No! <laughs> the kid's unconscious. <laughs> cool, I put the uh, canvas bag I have in my pack over his head. You put the what? I have a canvas bag in my pack. I, I just want to cover his head with a canvas bag so we can't see where we take him. Does anybody got any smelling shots? I'm not, I'm not done with them. Uh, Wake them up. I also want to reclaim my uh, uh, manacles if they're still usable. Everyone there? Um, I'm sorry. I just uh, I'm just writing shit down. Um, alright, I'm sorry, what do you want to do real quick, uh, go ahead? I want, if my manacles aren't busted because he slipped out with Dex, I want to reclaim them. Put nuggets in the mic with you. Like, I want to pick my manacles up if they're still, if they're not broken. Right, okay. Um, no, they're, they're not broken, no. You can pick them up. And then, I want to cover the, uh, kid's head with a canvas bag so he can't see where we take him. Alright, so now the kid's blind and unconscious and everything. Yep. Caesar! <laughs> so with the kid unconscious and the zombies dead with nine with twenty <laughs> nineteen fucking non-lethal smacking damage, the kid is unconscious. And put a burlap sack over his head and just yeah. A burlap and, sack. And with that, we'll end the session here. Oh, Do the man. anime music. And I, I'm assuming you guys just want to interrogate this kid. Yes. I am I am so glad I decided to bring my scalpel and pliers from my chest back at base with me for this. <laughs> I have a crowbar. Oh. I have a crowbar. <laughs> I, I also have ball bearings. Some hot <laughs> wax. I have, I have a flask of oil. Kinky. Yes, yes. No, 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 no. The wax goes on eyeballs. Oh, oh God. No. Jesus. Oh, no. <laughs> we're, we're just going to move underneath this roof where there's some privacy. <laughs> Lost contact. <laughs> the wax solidifies on the eyeballs. You can remove them and reuse it. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Alright, that wraps up episode 10. GG, guys. Oh, GG, me, guys. Uh, GG's. <laughs> that was a fun one. Out, guys? GG, guys. Out of bounds. Next episode is called the Geneva Conventions. Oh my god. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Alright, you guys. I mean checklist. Hells yeah. So, Geneva you know, um, Convention well, question mark. <laughs> thanks for a fun game, Serge. Yeah, no problem. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll get back again on uh what's it called? Well, we're already at the end of this month. That's crazy. Alright, so yeah. Yeah, the 13th right? of October, I think. What? Sounds good. Well, I gotta look up when I'm going on vacation. See what's up. Okay. <laughs> it should be after that, but oh, yeah. October. All right. Sounds good, man. Thank you. All right. Bye. See yep, cheers, everyone. Thanks for chilling. Have a good night. Yep. Night. Well, don't you mean December? What? I mean September and October. Oh, yeah, September. My bad. I don't know why I was in October. Fuck. Um, yeah, so the 8th of September. <laughs> Alright, guys. Um, Alright, thanks for chilling, guys. Peace out. Peace out, man. Okay, so...
That concludes episode 10. We'll see. We'll pick it up again. 4 o'clock that Sunday. And see where the camp can keep going from there. Look like Fasa. It looks like they found somebody that was involved in all these undead turnings. So we'll see what's up. They obviously want to get more info.